da 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 Da, da, da. All right, it looks like we're live. What is going on, everybody? Rogers Bass here, and welcome to the very first part of my first ever playthrough of a brand new generation of Pokemon, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Welcome to the stream, everybody. I am so unbelievably excited to play this today. Yesterday, I was chilling at Disneyland. I was hanging out with friends. All earlier this week, I've been setting up for this playthrough. Look at our beautiful playthrough screen. I got my nice HD camera. I got the chat looking nice on the bottom. I got the game preloaded up with the patch and everything. We're good to go. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Of course, shout out to Nintendo. Hashtag free game. Hashtag free product. You guys know the drill. I posted up all the artwork of Karoo the Quaxley earlier on Twitter as well. I have a new Karoo emote for my members in the chat. Today is going to be so much fun. I've heard that there are some tech issues with the game based on like early impressions that I was hearing from people yesterday that I was seeing on Twitter. So hopefully I don't run into too many of those. But I think regardless, I'm going to have a good time. It's a new Pokemon generation. I'm excited to see the new Pokemon. I've seen a lot of the new ones already, but I know there's going to be a few surprises as well. I haven't really seen anything about the story, though, and so I'm actually pretty excited about that. Shout out, by the way, to Game Prodigy coming through with a 49-month membership saying another sub to my boy appreciate all you do roger not going to be here for long because i want to go in partially blind i want to experience the game for myself i'll be sure to like comment subscribe and watch later though hashtag like spike you already know thank you very much for showing up and also i'm glad you bring that up game prodigy because i know a lot of people worried about spoilers and things like that this is going to be a game where i am taking my time uh this is an open world game the first ever open world Pokemon game beyond Arceus. I don't actually fully think Arceus is an open world Pokemon game because it's more like Monster Hunter. You're in areas that are open world. This is like an actual open world game. So I, I really, I don't know what to expect, but I know it's going to be fun. I know there's going to be a lot of things that I could sort of go off the beaten path to go and find. And so again, I've been waiting so long for this. I want to take my time. So I don't know how frequently over the course of the next few weeks I'm going to be streaming it. It could be twice a week. It could be three times a week. It could just be whatever the heck I feel like it but that is the plan for Pokemon Scarlet of course I'm doing my big launch playthrough right here on YouTube gaming today and then tomorrow I'm gonna to be doing that on Twitch I'm gonna be doing giveaways over the weekend I'm currently doing a giveaway as well we're just we're gonna be having a lot of fun you can see I already have my Lickitung up on my shelf back there Pikachu's back here Lickitung's over here Rowlet's over there as well so I don't want to wait any longer I've waited long enough. Pokemon Scarlet, here we go. Let's get started. I'm seeing lots of people in my chat already. Thank you to Melanair for becoming a member. Thank you to Super Mario WZ for becoming a member for 20 months. Greatly appreciate that. And yeah, I don't really know what I'm prioritizing first. I'm seeing you say, are we gonna do story first? Are we gonna do open world? I am doing whatever the heck I feel like. That is what I'm doing for this game. Das Poof in the chat going, it's time. It is time indeed, my friend. Let's go. Choose a look for yourself, yo. <laughs> Thank you, Super Mario WZ. Appreciate it. All right, let me know, by the way, if the audio is good. If I need to adjust things, just let me know. All right, choose a look for myself. Obviously that. He's got the swoopy hair. He's got the brown hair. Let's do this. What is my name? Come on, bro. You know my name. Rogers. Bass. Obviously. All right, make sure that's open. Also, boop. Let me bring this over here and adjust it on the off chance that we have a tech issue. I just want to have another screen available, but I think we actually should be okay. Um, I did a whole secret stream earlier in the week where I was setting everything up, and really, it does look so good. Okay, boom. Thank you to all the new subscribers as well. This is fantastic already. Welcome. All right. Are you ready with these settings? English and Rogers base. Can I change my hairstyle? Let's see. What do we got? I kind of like that one though. Long and straight, probably not this. Definitely not. Nope. Nope. Oh, I kind of like that actually, but that's more of a girl's hairstyle. So, I, you know what? I think I like this. I'm going typical. We might order other, oh, wait a minute. Hold on, Pompadour. Oh, I, I kind of, I don't hate that. Let's see. I wish you just said Quaxley Swoop. I kind of like this, actually. Actually, I kind of like this. It's a little messy. It's like my hair right now. I kind of like it. I'm going with this. Final answer. Confirm. 
Yes, go with this style. Perfect. All right, let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Select. Let's go. You guys are saying the game sound is too loud? I got you. I'll turn it down just a little bit. Again, first time playing, we got to adjust some things. My enrollment application at the Naranja Academy. Okay. What have you seen now saving on the screen? Your progress is being automatically saved. Thank you, by the way, Zay Miller. Subscribing for 31 months. That is my guy right there. Thank you very, very much. Naranja Academy. Taking lessons from tradition. Growing stronger and greater. Okay. Got the library over there. <laughs> All right, it's time for you two to dive into the world of Pokemon. I'm ready. The music's good so far, too. All right. By the way, you didn't customize your eyes, eyebrow, eye, wait, what? Your eyes, eyebrows, mouth, and more? I didn't even know all of these things are customizable. I'll have to do that. All right. Clavel, head of Naranja Academy. Let's see this. Paldea is a sprawling region, bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes. It is also, of course, home to the mysterious creatures known to us as Pokemon. All right. Thank you, by the way, to Metroid Dread for donating and saying, hope you have a great time. Heard the game's a little buggy, but I'm sure they're going to fix the issues. Yeah, that's, honestly, that's kind of how I feel right now, too. I'm like, if it's a little buggy on launch day, that's okay. I'm sure they'll fix it. This is one of the biggest media franchises in the world. If they don't fix Pokemon, it's like, come on. All right. Here we go. Cute little palmy <laughs> with his little hair swoop as well. <laughs> Pokemon can be found living all over in the seas, in the skies, and even in our cities and towns. Humans coexist with Pokemon as we both help one another to live and thrive. All right. Pretty, 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 pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Eli saying, Roger, jumping in with my wife this weekend, but couldn't miss your kickoff stream. I know your energy is going to have me even more amped to play. I might be Team Fue Coco over here, but enjoy it, Quaxley boy. Thank you, Eli. Shout out to Eli from Studio MDHR. Much love to you and the whole studio. I know the Cuphead boys are playing Pokemon this weekend as well. Thank you very, very much, Eli. Appreciate it. Within our halls, people from all regions gather to study together. And as Pokemon trainers, they have their Pokemon do battle. That is what I want to get. I want Peldea and Tauros, please. A vision. I want that a lot. All right. Our robust curriculum of coursework helps our students draw forth the fullest potential. It is within these walls that you will find your friends, your Pokemon, and your true self. We, the faculty and staff at Naranja Academy, can't wait to welcome you with open arms. I am ready. Mm, 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 mm. We got Karite on there, flying through the sky. Let's do this. Pokemon Scarlet. The first ever fully open world Pokemon game. We are here, boys. We are here. Look at all those Tauros running around. JC, why are you playing Mario Kart right now? Get off Mario Kart. All right. Let's see this. Flamingos? Wait, what are these guys? I want one of them. Let's see this. Okay, so Crydon's like flying all over the region? <laughs> all right, landing in the water. Little Pompadour parakeets, too? <laughs> you gotta catch a flamingo and call it Doe Flamingo? Oh, 100%. It's gonna be called Dofi. Of, of course, I have to. Thank you, by the way, to Josh S. saying, Hope you enjoy your Pokemon journey. I'm starting my own right now. Hey, thank you for the donation, Josh. Appreciate that. Nakama. Shout out to all the people in here already. Welcome. All right. Here we go. Now saving. Let's see this. Thank you, by the way, to Sultan. Appreciate that. Member for 21 months. Let's go. Appreciate that. Thank you very, very much. Thank you, Sultan. All right, let's get up. 
Let's see the world. I'm ready. I gotta change my look though. We got Applin over there as well. Hatchrem. Sh thank you to Shard Pop too. Lord Almighty, we're getting so many donations early on. Shard Pop saying, I've been playing all night and barely progressed the story. The open world owns, and by the way, the Flamingo is actually on my team. Interesting. By the way, the game reads the color of your Joy-Cons and makes the Switch in your room have those colors. That makes sense, because you can see over there I got the little new Nintendo Switch system, the one with the bigger screen. It's got my OLED Switch on there. Very cool. All right, change look, right? That's what I got to go to. Options. Oh, whoa, 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 there's a lot of stuff on here. Show nicknames, obviously show that. Skip cutscenes. Background music, sound effects. I'm going to turn sound effects down to nine. I'm going to turn both of these actually down to eight. Controller rumble, helping functions. Okay. Text speed, normal. I'd actually like to go fast. Skip move learning. You can choose not to be prompted to teach Pokemon new moves as soon as they level up. What? I definitely don't want that. Sent to boxes, manual, right? Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, save. Let's go. Interesting. And then save. Yeah, I guess I'll save so far. So many donations already, man. Shard Pop. Um, oh, I read that already. John Stoops said, I can't believe how far Pokemon games have come. I grew up playing Pokemon Sapphire and Ruby. It's beautiful, and I'm ready to complete the open world. Excited for your playthrough. Thank you, James. And, uh, oh, John, I just said James. I said James because I saw James. <laughs> John Stoops, shout out to you. And beautiful Joe Star said, once again, I'm honored to be a judge this year for the manga of the year. Have a great one. Thank you very, very much. And Frogman it says, is this pre-recorded? This is not pre-recorded. This is a live playthrough right now. No, this is not pre-recorded, Frogman. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right. Now, hold on. Let's see over here. Let's see. Your own wardrobe. Where am I going? We got some things on the wall. Your mom built these shelves. Okay, we got some belongings over there. I've learned to check everything from playing Pokemon games as a kid. Adventure guide, okay. I got my clothes, my fluffy bed. Look at this Squabbit plushie. <laughs> I kind of like this loft bedroom. That's kind of neat. All right, well, let's go. Got a dancer over there. All right. Squabbit! Muncha! <laughs> I've always liked Squabbit, I think they're cute. Okay. Now saving. You got the little substitute thing over there as well. Muncha, Muncha! <laughs> What's up, Squabbit, buddy? I'm sure I'll catch one of you in the wild sooner rather than later. <laughs> Let's see. Good morning, Rogers Base. Good morning, Mom! Also, I just realized I haven't showed it off yet. I'm wearing my Pokemon sweater right now as well. Got my Alolan Ninetales. I don't know if Alolan Ninetales is in the game, but we're going to find out. Okay. It's your first day at your new school after all. I'm so excited for you. You might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door, though. The school contacted me and said that you're supposed to wait here a little while longer. Their words, not mine. There's something very important on your first day that hasn't arrived yet. Okay. I'll get the door. I like the little Pikachu magnet on the fridge as well. Can I open up the fridge? Get some food? There are sandwich ingredients in here. Okay. Muncha! <laughs> Alright, what's up? Do forgive the intrusion. Let's see. You are Master Rogers Base, correct? Thank you, by the way, to Valdez saying greetings from Bolivia. Been loving your content for years. Thank you very much. Appreciate that, Nakama. And Gabe Ortiz coming through with a $20 donation saying it is Pokemon time. Looking forward to seeing the Pokemon you're going to use. Hope you enjoy the game. I am sure I am going to. Welcome to the stream. And Disney Duncan also donated and said happy 10th anniversary to the Wii U. There you go. All right, on behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents and also my delay in introducing myself. He's got a bunch of premium balls. The director of Naranja, you may call me Mr. Clavel. Director? And you came in person to help my son with his first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire Academy, including failures on its part. So here at last are the enrollment documents that you should have already been delivered. All right. Here's the bag. 
<laughs> no nuance to the animation, just... Can I offer you a cup of tea at least? Alright, no, no need to trouble yourself. Here we go. I've got a thing or two to discuss with the director here. Let's go. Why don't you go back up to your room? Okay. Here we go. Mr. Clavel, you simply must join me for a cuppa. Okay. She said the adults are talking. You gotta go back. Thank you, by the way, to Benjamin D. Saying, can't wait to play myself. My copy of Scarlet was delayed, but I'm gonna watch you play in the meantime. Gen 9 Hype. Let's go. All right, let's grab this. Get my hat and my backpack. Ready to put on your hat and you grab your bag? Of course. Of course, let's go. Get all dressed up in my weird little outfit. <laughs> ah. All right. Disney Duncan also donated again and said, have you beaten Ragnarok yet? I did, no spoilers, please. I'm not even out of the first Wetlands area, and I'm probably not gonna touch Ragnarok again until after I beat Pokemon. That's where I am right now. All right, main menu, save option, adventure guide, easy. Let's see, bag. What else is over here? Key items. All right. How long you plan for today? I'm not sure. A long while, probably. I've been waiting a long time for Pokemon, so it's probably going to be a long stream. All right. I got my hat in my bag. Let's see this. Look at you, all ready for your big day. <laughs> all right. The uniform of Storied Academy suits you quite well indeed. How careless of me. I'd entirely forgotten that I have something else for you, Master Rogers Base. A most important thing. All right. Can you give me my starter, please? Greetings from Hawaii. Greetings. Aloha. All right. I wonder what the important thing might be. Let's follow the director and find out. Let's go. All right. Get out of here. I'm excited to change my clothes. I don't want to be in this outfit for too long. All right. Here we go. Let me see. The game is still too loud. Uh, you can press left on the D-pad to change your look. All right, I'm going to turn the game audio down a little bit then if it's still too loud. Let me know. Tell me if that's better or now if it's too quiet. And, uh, and I'll also adjust my look with left on the D-pad. All right, here we go. Here's the starters. There they are. <laughs> Happy little, dude, how could you not love Quaxley? He's got the Rogers base hair flip. He's cute. He's on the thumbnail. We got to go with crew. I actually like all three of them this time around, though. I think Sprigatito, I think Fue Coco, I think they're all cute. All right. I'm going to ask you to choose which of these three you want as a partner. Sprigatito. <laughs> Very cute. That's what Reagan's going to go with. You got Fue Coco. I'm in love with Fue Coco. But I'm not using Fue Coco, though. I do like him, though. And then, of course, the one and only Quaxley. The duckling Pokemon, Pomp, <laughs> they're all good company. They usually refuse to leave my side. All right, let's do this. Look how cute they are looking up at me. What's this? Turns out they're more interested in you, Rogers Base, than familiar old me. I wish I could stay and see which one you'll choose, but I must be off. Oh, he's just leaving me with all three? Then I'll take all three. What's this? I'll be at the house over there. Take your time, and then come find me once your mind is made up. Look how cute they are, man. <laughs> what a mannerly fellow that director of yours is. These three are lovely, but you need to choose just one, right? Not an easy task. Yes, it is. They have lots to teach you. Just walk around with them. Uh, but before you go, I got a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you're going out on your own. All right. The Rotom phone. Put the Rotom phone in your bag's key item pocket. All right, a brand new phone. And according to instructions, you can check the map by pressing the Y button. Keeps from getting lost. Easy. All right, let's see this. I'm obviously, as cute as they are, I'm going with Quaxley. Come on. Oh, are they all just going to walk with me? All right, well, let's go. Come on, buddies. Oh, look how cute they are. Look at them run. <laughs> oh, man. Very cute indeed. There's the map. Wait, whoa, 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 a lot of stuff here. Hold on. Adding apps gives a trainer access to useful functions. You can find useful information around the Paldea region if you move the map cursor. You're going to rotate your own view along with the map. And the left stick to magnify glass around the map, too. 
Okay. And a flying taxi service like the Corviknights, but now there's time they're little parakeets. Okay. We got a whole bunch of stuff on this map. And you could zoom in. We got some weasels. We got some wingles. All right, wait. I want to change my look real quick, too. You guys said I could change my look. Oh! Wait a minute. Different uniforms. Let's go with the autumn one. We got the winter one as well. Oh, I like the winter one. Wait a minute. And then spring. Hold on. I'm going with the winter one. I like the winter one. Let's go with that. Let's go with the crew socks. Let's go with performance sneakers. School gloves. I'll go with that. Canvas backpack. Yeah, I like that one better. Nothing really matches right now, but that's okay. I like that the icon for the hats is a straw hat, which obviously I'll change to when we get it, but... Alright, sporty cap. School helmet. Definitely not that. I'm going with the sporty cap. Horn rim glasses. There we go, okay. Actually, I don't really like those very much. Those aren't the same as my regular glasses. Let me remove those. And then default case, okay. And then change look. Yes. Let's customize. All right, eye shape. Let's see. Eye shape two. Eye shape three. I kind of like the first eye shape. I like that one too, though. The first one looks more excited and happy. <laughs> he looks kind of bored. What's the difference between nine and one? Oh, nine's like a little bigger. Okay, I'll go with that. Wow, you can really customize. All right, gray eyes, obviously. Just like mine. Ultramarine. Poppy red. Like gray. Oh, they have like a lot of options. All right. Blue gray. Ooh, blue gray. Wow. That's like mine. All right, we're doing that. Blue gray. They never have that as an option. We're going with that. Blue gray. Got some eyelashes. All right. <laughs> Whoa, wait a minute. All right, I'm going with just the regular one. Default. Well, I don't know. Yeah, I'm going with default. Default. Eyelash color. Just normal eyebrows. Let's see. What kind of eyebrows am I going to have? Give me some thick brows, please. Those are probably better. <laughs> I kind of like that. He looks worried. I like that. I kind of like that, actually. Let's see. They don't really match mine, but that's okay. Let's see. Well, I kind of like those, actually. I'll go with those. Or, let's see. There's a lot of different options. Let's go with... Brow F. Yeah, I like that for now. Eyebrow color, obviously the same as my hair. Why would I change that? Mouth. Okay. Let's see. Preview. What's the difference between these three mouths? This one's just a little bigger. I like that one. Oh, I like that one. A little bit of a smile on that. <laughs> not, not that one. I don't like that one. Um, let's go with... Let me see, let me see. I kind of like that one too, actually. Um... Let's see. Let me see. Let's go with this one. This one. Yeah, let's go with that one. Perfect. Okay. Lip color. Whoa. <laughs> no, I'm good. No color. Thank you. Uh, no beauty spot. I'm good. No freckles. I'm good. I think I'm good with this for now. I'm going to say select, do a full preview. I'm good for now with this. I can always change it later. Go back, select. Oops, no, I wanted to go back. Other eye shape. There we go, there we go. Back. Go with this look. Perfect. Then back again. Yeah, I actually kind of like this for now. All right. Let's go, little buddies. Let's go. <laughs> Very good. Very, very good. Mochi Mochi says, hello, Roger. Hello. And Rob said, there's a problem. Mackerel can't chat. We'll fix it. 
You're a mod, fix it. Make it so we can. I'm in the middle of playing right now. All right, hold on. The power of science. You got a little... What is that thing? You need to take these three Pokemon to your neighbor's house down the way? But there's, like, other stuff going on over here. Hold on a minute. Let's see. Make our way down to the house. Let's see. All right, I want to get my starter. Here we go. Ah. Here we go. Got my squad with me. Okay. He's so cute. I can't get over how cute they made Blacksley. Oh, man. So cute. And then Fue Coco. <laughs> Eating his little apple. You know, we kind of burned that to a crisp, but... <laughs> it's okay, buddy. You tried your best. Oh, is this Nimona or N Nimoda or something? We saw her in one of the earlier trailers. See, the thing is, it's weird. It's like, for a lot of the long-form trailers, I kind of skipped watching them because I didn't want to know too much. All right, we're going to choose. Let's go. Spuregatito, Quaxley, and Fue Coco. Qu Quax is like, bro, don't eat that. Put that down. Don't put that in your mouth. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're choosing. The time is now. You guys already know, though. This isn't even a surprise or a shock. You know who I'm going with. Obviously. Buenas. Ooh. I kind of like the theme. Mmm. 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 Hang on, director. Is this who I think it is? Our Academy's newest student, Master Rogers Base. He'll be attending as of today. Okay. So you're that kid who moved up in the road, right? I've been dying to find out more about you. Namona, that's right. Normally I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What are you saying, new neighbor? You want to be friends? Yes, I do. Let's be friends. Namona is president of our school council and a champion ranked trainer in her own right. I love Pokemon battling. In fact, we should battle right now, you and me. You're a champion. I'm a little kid who just moved in across the street. And I'm still going to beat you. <laughs> also, how is she in my class if she's already a champion? That's not fair. All right, on that note, Master Rogers Base, let's see. <laughs> Have you decided which of these Pokemon you would like to be your first partner? Of course, Quaxley all day, every day. I know this. Come on, Quaxley. <laughs> Here he is. That's Quaxley, a water type. It may seem quiet, but its mighty streams of water can put out any fire. You'll see. All right, now, would you like to go with our good water type? Yes. Pump, pop. Let's go. You chose Quaxley. Are you going to give Quaxley a nickname? Of course. Quaxley is going to be nicknamed after Princess Vivi's pet duck in One Piece. And, of course, there's already a beautiful piece of art that my thumbnail artist James did of Quaxley Carew, and he's a boy, perfect, Quaxley Carew, first try, let's go, you're my new buddy, <laughs> John Stoop said 10 year old Rogers Base is about to be handing out L's, <laughs> look how cute, so cute, that's so cute, I love it, I love it, oh, my little buddy's with me, I love it, I love it, I love it, I'm ready, <laughs> Quaxley seems to have taken a liking to you, Master Rogers Base, of course. All my members, if you're in the chat right now, spam that Karoo emote that I made just for today. All right, this is your first Pokemon, yes? Let's raise it with love and care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked away safely inside a Pokeball. Okay, here we go. Whoop! Here we go. I can't even believe you chose Quaxley. Well, why not? I mean, like, way to make the perfect choice for you. You two make such a good combo. Oh, of course. Of course. <laughs> Can I choose one of these Pokemon too, Director Clavel? I thought you were already a champion level trainer. What do you need a new Pokemon for? Did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy? I had other Pokemon I was raising at the time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon? Okay. Fine. If you wish to uh, raise one on equal footing, I shall be more than happy to allow it. 
Okay, Namona. Who are you taking? Sprigatito or Fue Coco? Oh, you're going for Fue Coco? <laughs> okay. Little Sprigatito's just going to be wandering the grounds then? Like the Disney cats? All right. Now that we've chosen our Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you are ready. Let's go. All right. Off we go. As you may have noticed, Nimona is a tad overly fond of Pokemon battling, but I do hope you'll join her for a battle. It'll help you get to know your own Pokemon as well. Let's go! Battle Nimona. Alright, we've got a little quest option available. I want to see the sights, but... Alright, let's go down to the beach. Here we go. Over here! I see you, I see you. Anyone can be a Pokemon trainer as long as they have Pokemon by their side. And it's our duty as trainers to help out our Pokemon grow stronger in battle. Okay. Ready to battle me, Rogers Base? I'm ready. Let's go. Perfecto. I'm so excited. For this battle, I think I'm going to use... Hmm? I trust you remember Master Rogers Base is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. Sprigatino wanted to see what's going on over here, too. Mm, good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. Well, I'll try out my new buddy instead. All right, let's go. We're about to destroy, absolutely destroy Fue Coco. <laughs> poor, poor Fue Coco. All right, let's have a fruitful battle. Let's go. Here we go. Pokemon Trainer Nimona. And Kuru versus. Alright, I know it's your first Pokemon battle, so let's just have some fun. You got it. Kuru, look at him. His little pose. Alright, we got the bag, run, battle. I kind of like the new, uh. I like the UI of the new battle. This is kind of nice. Alright, water gun, obviously. Poor Fue Coco, <laughs> getting hit. You must have been studying up. Smart move. Water is strong against fire. Going for a tackle, that's fine. I'm going with another water gun, let's go. Karu! <laughs> Poor Fue Coco. Poor little guy. First he burned his apple. All right, we're already level six. Good work, Karu. Oh, I like the new little level up music. All right, not bad, neighbor. I got $300 in prize money. Let's go. Look at you winning your first battle ever. You've got even more potential than I thought. You're gonna be a strong trainer for sure. But now I just wanna try a different strategy. Let's go again. One more battle. Fine, I'll fight you again. My little guy's looking excited. Sprigatito's off doing his own thing. <laughs> I got caught up in the excitement. I'm sorry, Roger. Same to your Quaxley, too. Don't worry about it. All right, thanks, Roger's base. You two seem to be fast friends, though you only just met. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing, Miss Nimona? I'm sure he could learn a great deal from a champion rank trainer such as yourself. You bet, sir! I think my Elgato's messing up too. The music was kind of fuzzy there a little bit. Alright, since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you need. You have a smartphone, right? Let's see it for a second. Here comes my Rotom phone. The Pokedex app. Alright, a must-have for Pokemon trainers. A super handy app. Once our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jacques, actually made it himself. Okay. Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. You're a liar, because I've been playing Pokemon since it came out in 1996, and from the very first game, we had digital Pokedexes that Professor Oak put together. So you're a liar, Clavel. I think you're gonna end up being evil just because you're lying in this very first moment. Quite the age we live in now. Get out of here. Filling out a Pokedex by hand? I can't even imagine how much work that would take. I suppose you can't. Alright, yet no matter how many times, <laughs> how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. A truly timeless pleasure. Alright. 
The more Pokemon that you encounter, the more you find yourself growing and changing. Rob said, well, what about Pokemon, uh, the Pokedex and Legends Arceus? Well, is this dude from the original old Sinnoh? I don't think so. He's only like 60. He's not 100-something. All right, I hope you'll both work towards the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. All right. Now, Miss Demona, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. Could I depend on you to see Master Rogers based to the Academy? All right. Of course, leave it to me. That I leave him in your capable hands. All right, little one, it's time you and I were on our way. So he gets Sprigatito. <laughs> that says to me that he's going to be the stronger trainer then, later in the game. All right, speaking of Pokedexes, you probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'm going to show you the ropes. I don't need you to. I'm good. But I'll follow her anyway. All right. Pokedex in a flash is the minus button, and you can navigate the Pokedex by pressing the X button on the map app. Okay. Here we go. Follow Nimona. What was this? Wait, what was this? What did I just do? Oh, you can slide? Oh, B button lets you slide and then crouch. Okay. I instinctively pressed B thinking it was going to make me run. Wait, wait, go back, go back, go back. Excuse me. All right, here we go. Here we go. Layout looks nice, Roger. Thank you, RW. All right, let's see this. Where did Nimona go over here? Let's get some new Pokemon. Is that my mom? Roger's base. I hear Nimona here will be taking you to school. She sure is. That's right, ma'am. Leave it to me. You already managed to make a friend. I read all about the wonderful teachers you're going to have looking after you at the school. So many handy facilities that you can use as much as you like. Add your new friend to Mona, and it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Okay. Now you're going to be staying in the school dorm, so I want you to promise me that you'll eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with, and she packed me a lunch. Wonderful. All right, sandwich from Mom. Here we go. You put in the sandwich from mom. A dish made by sandwiching vegetables, meat, or other ingredients between two pieces of bread. It makes a fantastic meal when out on a picnic. <laughs> okay. Five potions, very good. A spray type medicine. You did on your precious little partner of yours should you get hurt in battle. I know every day in your new life is going to be full of exciting experiences far from home. Just try to savor them all. The good times and the hard times too. If you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. Of course, of course. You two better be off. I really quickly want to get some water, too. While we're still in this tutorial phase, I want to fill this back up. Turn the AC down a little. There we go. <laughs> Reagan's sitting on the couch getting ready to play herself as well. She's got Violet version, I got Scarlet version. Got some more water over here. Okay. Your mom's so nice, Roger's base. But I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on. Vamos! Let's go. Alright, make our way up here. This way. I am excited to be actually able to go all over the place and catch other Pokemon and stuff. All right. Here we go. We got another trainer over here. Or I guess are we going down that route first? I was going to go back to my house, but all right. Here we are. First Pokemon. Let's do this. Poco Path. Oh, there's little items back there and stuff too. Oh, this is going to be fun. I'm excited. I am really excited. Here is Poco Path. All right. Got the little pigs all over the... Wait, was that... What was that thing? We got Palmy and then the little pigs. It's the path that leads to adventure for you and me. Things are different than in town. You're going to see wild Pokemon out and about. Okay. 
Yeah, I got Quaxley. I'm good. Got to use a good old Pokeball if you want to catch a Pokemon. You got tons? All right, give it to me. A device for catching wild Pokemon. And we got one right over here. <laughs> what luck! Time to learn by doing. Try battling this little Lechonk. All right, let's go. We got the battle theme for the first time. Actually, let me listen to this for a second. Hold on. I, I want to hear it. This is my first time doing it. So give me a second. Okay. It's a weird mix of instruments at first. <laughs> that weird horn coming in. Don't that don't that don't that don't. Then it gets kind of serious there for a second. It's almost like it's got elements of other Pokemon themes in it. I'm getting a little bit of the vibe of the original Gen 1 games. I'm getting a little bit of an Alola vibe as well. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Let's try this. I'm sure I'm going to hear more of it over time, so. All right. Here we go, Quaxley. You ready for this? Water gun. <laughs> Get ourselves a little chonk. All right, tackle, perfect. All right, grab the Pokeball. I also like that the Pokeball's back on the X button. You don't have to go through all the menus for it. Fantastic. Okay. Perfect. Lechonk was caught. Excellent. Got my first Pokemon. Lovely. Can I nickname him? The Hog Pokemon. It searches for food all day and possesses a keen sense of smell, but doesn't use it for anything other than foraging. Okay, want to give Lechonk a nickname? I sure do. I'm gonna name him... What am I gonna name Lechonk? My first Pokemon. I want it to be something bacon related. I'm gonna name him Applewood. Applewood, there you go. Because normally, when there's like a pig Pokemon, I name it Applesauce. Because I always make a joke that like, if I was going to have a pet pig, I want to name it Applesauce because it's a cute name. Because Applesauce goes good with pork chops. But Applewood is actually a cuter name, I think. I'm going with Applewood. Applewood, the Lechonk, final answer. Let's go. Applewood's been added to your party. Let's go. Boom. Oh, I like the look of the Pokedex as well. The little books. Okay. That was awesome. You caught your very first Pokemon. Thank you, by the way, to Soup Lover, being a member for four months, saying, you, can you twirl in the game like you could in Sword and Shield? I'll try it. I'm crummy when it comes to catching Pokemon. You should give me tips? Sure. Have some more Pokeballs just in case. Not every catch works out. All right, we got 10 of these. Let's see. We can the Pokemon, then throw the Pokeball. Remember that, and you'll be A-OK. -okay. Now go battle those wild Pokemon and catch some. You got it! Let's meet back up at the lighthouse over there. You can see our school from the top. Excuse me. Alright, well let's go fight. I'm ready. You can start a battle by looking toward a wild Pokemon and throwing a Pokeball by pressing the ZR button. Try this tactic out to battle Pokemon that are up in trees or flying in the sky. Okay. Interesting. So you can't catch them fully on the field like you could in Arceus then? All right, let's do this, I'm ready. I wanna go back and try to get the one that was in the tree over here. Wasn't there a little spider over here earlier? I guess I can't get that thing. Also, aren't there Wingle over by the beach? I saw that on the map earlier, hold on. Let's see, we got Wingle by the beach, we got Bweasel, we got Hopip. I do like Hopip. Let's see, actually, you know what? No, I'm not gonna get Wingle just yet, that's fine. I already have Quaxley, I'm good. See what's over here. We got another Lechonk. I want to get one of those little spider guys. 
All right, let's see. Whoa, 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 hold on. Oh, you get the Pokeball back that you throw? Oh, that's kind of interesting. Well, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Quaxley? Let's attack these guys again. Oh, look at their little... Oh, look at their little heads. <laughs> that's cute. Here, let's fight this Lechonk again. You can go get some extra experience points. Water gun. Karu. I'm just knocking them all out. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh. All right, Wild Lechonk fainted. Applewood's getting some experience in the back, too. Very good. We got a Lechonk hair. All right, I want this. How do I, how do I aim it? Isn't it ZR? Oh, oh, there's one over there. Hold on. Yeah, that's one of these guys. He's kind of cute. I like him. Little yarn spider. Taro... Taro Unchula? Taro Unchula. Okay. Catch him. Boom. Taro Unchula. Use tackle. All right, let's catch one. And it's a girl. Okay, boom. All right, Taro Unchula was caught. Let's see. Level seven already with my Karu. All those little chunks in the background are getting kind of freaked out too. You got work up. The string ball Pokemon. A ball of threads wrapped around its body is elastic enough to deflect the size of a Scyther. This Pokemon's natural enemy. Oh. Yeah, I'll give Taro and Tula a name. Let's name her Gwen. Like Spider Gwen. Real original, I'm sure, but... Alright. Boom! Gwen has been added to the party. They're kind of cute! Alright, Taro and Tula. Now let's actually see what their moves are. Oh, Auto Heal! Wait, what is this? Auto Heal will select the items from your bag. You can just press... Oh, and it uses up the worst ones first. I like that. Oh, that's good. Okay. Bag, boxes, options. So if I do this... Whoops, wrong one, wrong one. I did the wrong button. Okay, Pokedex app. Okay, Lechonk, Tarantula, and Quaxley. And I saw Fue Coco. But then, alright. Let's see this. That's notices. Oh, this is camera mode! Okay, so this is like if we're gonna take selfies or something. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Look around, look for a little Lechonk or something. Hey, there he is! <laughs> Hello, Lechonk. Let's see, we got some filters. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> All right, hold on. And then we got this. Oh, we have a little emotes on the field. All right, cute. Like the video. All right. And then apparently if you hold ZL and then you aim, that's how you enter the battle with stuff that's in the tree. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay. So battle, water gun again, Karu. By the way, Roger, if you press the R button, what is that? Press the R button to let your Pokemon roam around and they'll fight and forage for you. Oh, that's good to know. I'll do that. I'll let Karu forage around while I'm messing around. By the way, Roger, it's Tarantula. Oh, like round spider. Tarantula, cute. All right, Applewood leveled up, fantastic. So if I use R, he can just go do, go off and do his own thing. I kind of like that. All right, cool. And then minus button auto heals, right? Because we've got, let's see, the Pokedex. Profile, map. And I could crouch. So the R button recalls him. And then I could also send him out again. Here, I'll go auto battle. Do your own thing. Perfect. Get some experience. That is awesome. Wow, I love that. Okay, we got another tower on Tula over there. 
Well, let's see what else we got. This thing over here. Got a Pokeball. Some potions. So now if I do that, will I auto heal? Because didn't they say minus button? Auto heals? Oh, you could like zoom out and zoom in. Okay. Got some hot pips over there. Let's get a hot pip. Let's go. Boom. Okay. Battle. Level one. Hot pip. Let's use water gun because I don't want to kill it. There we go. One more. I'm going to hop it, just level up in the background. That'll be good. I've always liked hop it. Okay. Tackle. Throw one of these. Get myself a hop it. Uh, for the auto heal, you have to be in the Pokemon list. Then you press the minus button to auto heal it. Got it, got it. So it's X and minus to auto heal then. Perfect. So let's see this then. The Cottonweed Pokemon. This Pokemon is blown across vast distances by the wild. Oh, excuse me, by the wind. I said wild. <laughs> it is unclear where the Hoppip of Paldea originally came from. All right, great. Hoppip a nickname. Let's name Hoppip. Magic. Fans of Shofu's videos will know the reference. And those of you who don't know the reference, it's all good. Don't worry about it. You're just not a real one, that's all. All right, boom. Hop it. All right, now the Pokemon menu. If I go over here and make Gwen the lead Pokemon, because Gwen's obviously a bug type, and Hop it's a grass type, so Gwen would be useful. Then I click Auto Heal. Oh, I love this. Yes, 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 yes. All right, Gwen, here's what I'm going to have you do. Gwen, go off, do your own thing. Fight some Hop it's. I'm going to get these items. Oh, I love this. Wore itself out. Wait, what? Gwen, go back. Come on, fight. Here we go. Wait, you didn't win? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on a minute. Gwen, I need you to level up. All right, I need you to do something. I can't just have you over here be useless. All right, take out this level two LeChonk, please. Roger, they also take damage each time you do that. You're sending a bug type against a flying type. True, but it's also a grass type. And they have no flying moves. They just have splash. If Gwen isn't holding up against a Hoppip, then Gwen might not stay on the squad, honestly. <laughs> All right, Gwen, come on. Tackle. Because Quaxley was a water type going up against a grass type. Had no problem. <laughs> All right, here we go. It's not attacking with bug moves yet, though. Oh, true. That's true. That's true. Auto takes type into account more than it takes moves into account. That's really good to know. By the way, you also will get Pokedex rewards when pressing X inside the Pokedex. Ooh, that's good to know. I didn't know that. All right, Gwen. Let's see this. Beautiful. We got more Lechonk cares. Let's see. Actually, you know what? Let's send. Let's do this. Heal up. I want to change position. I want to put Quaxley out in front, too. Gets Karu some level ups. All right, let's go. Karu, go off. Go off, King. He defeated a hop hit perfectly. Dude, I love this. This is such a better way to grind and level up. This is so much better. All right, Karu, let's heal you up, buddy. Here we go. Come here. Heal up. Yeah, I love this. Because then he could just go off and fight and do his own thing. Oh, my Pokedex has been updated. What just happened? Defeated a Scatterbug. There was a Scatterbug over there? Wait, I want a Scatterbug. I thought it was just hopping. Hold on. Go back. Go back real quick. Heal him up again. Oh, I don't have any handy? Uh-oh. All right, Applewood, I'm going to have you switch then. Boom. You're now the lead, Applewood. Dude, there's so much... Hound hours? Wait, 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 wait. There's a whole bunch of stuff on this map. Hound hour and Amy Adams this early on? Amy Adams Talonflame? I got to find one of those. 
Yo, Applewood's killing it. All right, good work, Applewood. Very good. Leveling up. Let's see. Let's get some of these. What's over there? Is that a Palmy? Level two? Yeah, let's get Palmy. Here, I don't want to. I don't want to kill it. Applewood, come back. Here, toss the Pokeball. Let's go. Palmy, look how tiny they are. They're so cute. All right, level two Palmy. Boom. I want to catch it. He's cute. Boom, tackle again, Applewood. Don't kill it, though. Static, that's good. That's a good thing to have. All right, Applewood's paralyzed. That's fine. He's just using Growl. I don't need to worry about it. All right, let's do bag. Catch ourselves a Palmy. How about that? All right. Yeah, the map is huge. There's like a lot of stuff to grab very early on. I love it. Okay, here we go. Duncan said, are you going to be streaming Fire Emblem Engage in January? Of course I am, naturally. All right, here we go. Disarming voice. Let's see this. And Temp, by the way, became a member and said, I hope you enjoy Pokemon Scarlet. Hey, thank you. All right, Palmy, the mouse Pokemon. It is underdeveloped electric sacs on its cheeks. The sacs can produce electricity only if Palmy rubs them furiously with the pads on its paws. <laughs> Give Palmy a nickname? I sure will. I'm gonna name Palmy. What am I gonna name Palmy? It rubs its cheek with its little paws. I know what I'm gonna name it. Garchu! <laughs> no, I'll just do this. Garchu. Garchu's been added to your party. All right. Garchu the Palmy. Perfect. I already got a bunch of Pokemon. Alright, I want to find... Where are they? I want to find Fletchling, which will turn into Talonflame. Where is there a Fletchling? Let's see. I'm hearing it. Is it in the tree, maybe? I don't know. Hold on. Here. Go off and do your own thing for a second. Thank you, LeChonk. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Defeat that Hoppip. Here, LeChonk, defeat this little guy, too. Boom. <laughs> Dude, LeChonk is killing it. This is fantastic. All right, let's look around. I want a Fletchling. I also want a little Scatterbug, too. Let's see. Where is Scatterbug? I'm seeing on the map. See, Fletchling should be right over here. But I don't see him. Maybe he's a little bit ahead. Let's see. Got another Hoppip over here. Take that one out right there. The map doesn't show Pokemon around you, just what can be found here. Oh, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, that's good to know. I'm up using Tackle. Uh-oh, poor Applewood. Applewood fainted. That's okay. You're coming back. Don't worry about it. Choose next Pokemon. I'm switching in Garchu. My level 2 Garchu. All right. Scratch it up. Oh, whoa. That did nothing. Good thing Hoppip did Splash. That did absolutely nothing. All right, Pokemon. Karoo, come on back in. Here we go. Let's see this. Karoo. Splash, that doesn't matter. All right, let's see. And then let's do Pound. Take out that Hoppip. Beautiful. Some of these Pokemon are real, real small. They sure are. Speaking of which, I gotta find a Smoliv. I need a Smoliv. That instantly has to be on the squad. All right. Let's see. What's this over here? I got something. A Lepa Berry, cool. Look at all these items. Oh, we got a potion. Here we go. Got another potion. Oh, this is good. There's potions all over the place. Ether. Scroll down here. Get another one. A super potion. All right. Let me go here. 
Oh, I have to revive him? Do I have a revive in my bag? I do. All right. Revive Applewood. There we go. And then let's auto-heal Karu. Let's auto-heal Garchu. Totally fine. Let's make Karu my lead again. And I'm just going to send him out to go do stuff while I'm looking for other Pokemon over here. All right, come on, Karu. Take him out. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. See, I got more items over here, too. Let's see. Grab this. Take out another Lechonk. There we go. <laughs> Karu's doing good work. All right. Come on, Karu. Do what you got to do. Come on. Come over here. <laughs> there we go. All right, perfect. I also find it so interesting that you get items from these other Pokemon. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, no, that's another little chalk. Okay. I wish I didn't, like, accidentally kill that Scatterbug, because I kind of like Vivalon. If there's another one over here, I do want to catch one. I go to look around in the grass. Let's see. Here, I'll probably see another one on my way. Not a po oh, oh, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Scatterbug. Scatterbug. No, no, no. Get over here, get over here. There we go. Scatterbug, level four. Perfect. Perfect. All right, Karu. I'm gonna have you do a water gun, but don't kill it. Please don't kill it. Perfect. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Speed harshly fell, not a big deal. Pokeball, let's go. Boom. By the way, Roger, all those items that you're getting from the Pokemon are materials you can use to craft TMs in this one. All right. I like that. Also, I feel like you get way more experience from actually fighting the Pokemon than you do, like, sending them off to roam. Any poison this Pokemon takes is converted into a black powder and secreted. That's why Scatterbug can eat poisonous leaves and roots. You want to give Scatterbug a nickname? Not yet. Not yet. Is this like Arceus where I can nickname them at any time or do I have to go to a nickname raider? Let's see. Summary, position. All right, so you can't. You have to go to a name raider. That's all right. All right, we got some more Lechonks. We got another Scatterbug over here. I'm going to auto heal these guys real quick. There we go. Quaxley. Boom. Take these guys out. I just want to grind a little bit. I want to make my Karoo the strongest little Karoo that ever was. Because <laughs> I already caught a whole bunch of Pokemon. Oh, Roger, you can actually rename anytime in summary. Oh, that's good to know. Okay, excellent. That's very good to know. Here we go. Level up again. Boom. Namora will also heal you as well. Oh, I should go back to Namora then. Here we go. Auto battles give you more uh, EXP if you attack groups or second evolutions. That's good to know. All right, water gun. Take out that Lechonk. There we go, level nine already, fantastic. Take out this Scatterbug, come on, Karu. <laughs> All right, here we go, water gun. Scatter bug. Got a string shot. That's A-OK. -okay. All right, pound. Roger, you should check to see if Pokemon can remember moves. Some know pretty busted moves, but they don't show up initially. How do you check that? Under summary, maybe? Let's see. Everyone's leveling up. You love to see it. All right, summary. Here we go. Karoo. Gwen, Magic, Garchu, Scatterbug. I am going to name uh, Scatterbug, actually. I'm going to name Scatterbug because he turns into Vivalon eventually. I'm going to name him... Nah, I'm not going to name him anything yet. Change nickname. Change moves. Oh, remember moves. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Interesting. 
So this is like Arceus as well. I love this. And you for you can forget a move at any time. And use TMs to learn moves. This is kind of nice. I love this new summary screen. Okay. Here we go. We got another scatter bug. Here, get over here, Quaxley. Boom! Let's go. All right. By the way, you are one of my favorite content creators. Oh, thank you, Vanilla Ice. Appreciate that. That's very sweet of you. All right, I should probably move around a little bit. By the way, if you attack groups, the EXP from one gets multiplied by five. Wow, that's pretty good. All right. Everybody's still leveling up. And now that I know that other characters can learn different moves and I go back to Nimona, I can heal everybody up. That'll be fantastic, moving on to the next route. Everyone's gonna be super strong. <laughs> Boom, taking out LeChonk. If you kill five Mons in a row, you also get bonus EXP. Oh! It's not just if you attack groups. Man, this is really good. Also, I notice now saving. It auto saves after every battle too? I like this. Okay, water gun, very good. Roger, what are the evolutions for Quaxley? Um, I know the final evolution is like a salsa dancer guy that I really like. And I don't know what the middle evolution is. I've only seen the final evolution. Here, let's go back to Nimona. Take these little guys out in the meantime. The Quaxley playthrough begins. Good to see it, Roger. Hey, good to see you, Zophus. All right, fight this guy. Come on, Karu. Beautiful. Tarantula. <laughs> Alright, I got a bunch of level 5s now. I'm feeling pretty good. Here we go. If your Pokemon are getting tired out, I'll heal them. Thank you. I don't want to waste my potions. Alright. If you see a Fletchling or a Houndour, let me know, because I really do want one. And if not, we're just going to move on to the next area. Because I could go anywhere, and I'm just sticking to this first route, but realistically, I could go wherever I want on this map and get whatever Pokemon I want. I haven't even been to this area yet, let's see. Got some berries, some goodies over here. Okay, whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh, another Scatterbug? Here, go on Quaxley, do what you gotta do. <laughs> Perfect. Get another one of these. Oh, here's that whole group you were talking about. All right, let's go Quaxley, come on. There's one. Oh, wore himself out, okay. And what's over here? Let's see. I don't have any... What? I thought I just got a berry. Is that another Palmy over there? Let's see. Let's fight. Boom! I know Palmy learns Thundershock at 3, though, so I gotta be careful. Ooh. Okay, this one's level 5, so wait a minute. We're gonna switch. Let's bring in... Let's bring an Applewood. Use Disarming Voice. Yeah, make sure to only auto attack with type advantage, otherwise the Pokemon can't farm the mods they attack. Good to know. Alright, here we go. Growlin. Very good to know. Let's go. Kira2020 said, please don't hate me. I've never played Pokemon before. I am intrigued though. Well, now is literally the best time to do it. Hop on in, join us. Leave your fields to flower. Thank you, by the way, Kira. Thank you very, very much for the subscription and for the donation, appreciate it. All right. Here we go, attack's fallen. Still doing a little damage, come on. All right, Palmy's using Growl. Also, a couple things. For those of you, if you want to be a member, if, you're, if you join as a member, I should say, you get the little Karoo emote, which is cute. And if you want to chat, just make sure to subscribe. The chat is open for everybody. You don't need to be a member or a mod or whatever to chat. You just need to be a subscriber. We do that to keep out all the other people that are sort of flooding in during, like, new game reveals and things like that. So, if you want to chat, 
Just subscribe, you'll be able to chat. All right, we're gonna tackle again with Applewood. Let's see this. Also, I'm pretty sure when you subscribe, it like shows up on the screen, so. Okay. Boom, Karoo's now level nine. I got a revive as well. Very nice. I'm gonna take out the Scatterbug too. Why not? I'm here. All right, Karoo. Do what you gotta do. The game looks super fun. It is super fun so far. I'm getting lost just walking around. All right. This game might be why I finally buy a Switch, not gonna lie. You don't have a Switch, Philly? You indeed should... Oh, oh, wing attack. Hold on. Wait, this is good. Good, good, good. What are we getting rid of? Let's get rid of Growl. Okay. Boom. Wing attack is gonna be great from we're going through hop-ups and scatter bugs and things like that. And these little tarantulas. Because now we can do super effective damage to them. Here, let's see this. Battle. Wing attack. Beautiful. Tarantula. Feign it. Everyone's leveling up still. Garchu's learning quick attack. You love to see it. All right. Here we go. Got another item over there. That's the, the area we went earlier, so I'm not going to go over there. What's this? You're getting the hang out to catch Pokemon now? I sure am. Let me see. So far, you caught... Hmm? New character? Go? Ooh, a strong Pokemon. I say we find whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around. Just be careful. Great, let's do it. I'm ready. Also, let's grab this item while we're here. Looking if there's anything in the tree. All right, ether. Kind of the little chonk over there. You can head this way later. Okay, so we got to go by the cliff then. Here we go. Let's see. What's it going to be? I'm assuming that's going to be the legendary that fell. Yep. There it is. Koridon with a bunch of Houndour. I got to catch one of those, honestly. I feel like that's probably pretty good. A good early dark type and a fire type. <laughs> Any other day, that legendary would destroy them. Uh-oh. Falling off the cliff? <laughs> the road of bone saved your fall? <laughs> Thank you, by the way, to Grant saying, Greetings from Michigan. I usually catch your One Piece chapter streams. Enjoy Scarlet and Violet. It's very good, and have a great Thanksgiving. I'll see you on Sunday. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you very much, Grant. All right, let's go see Koridon. Here we go. Oh, is he hungry? Seems to be too weak to move. Can you maybe give it something to perk it up? Sure. I got a sandwich. Here you go. Have this sandwich my mom made me. <laughs> Gia? Careful! Almost bit off that poor kid's hand. Alright, here we go. Aegeus. Can I already ride on the back of Koridon? Like this early? Oh no, he's going off in that cave or something. Oh! 
He's back to normal. That sandwich had magical powers then. <laughs> Thank you, child, for giving me a Subway sandwich. I appreciate it. You got it, boss. All right, off he goes. I guess I should follow him. Is there no other like little item over here I should grab? Because I always feel like Pokemon's sneaky. You should check everything to make sure there's items. Okay. Here we go. The Inlet Grotto. So he's just walking around with us then, okay. Get some other little items in there. I guess we gotta stay behind him. Also surprised there's no Pokemon in this grotto. I'm hearing them. Oh, Namona's all the way up there. There you are. You're okay. You're not hurt, right? I'm fine. I just got a legendary. <laughs> if you'd gotten hurt because I said we should go looking for whatever made that cry, well, never mind that. Right now, we gotta focus on getting you back up here. You just gotta find a way to climb out of there. If you get close enough, I'll try pulling you up with one of my Pokemon moves. You got it. And what is that Pokemon in front of you? It looks super strong. Yeah, I'd rather follow this thing than go up and hang out with you. There's a Houndour! Wait, I want one of these. I want one, I want one, I want one. Seems like they're running away, though. There's a Houndoom up there, too. Look at that. We got a Young Goose. I'll fight this thing. Here we go. <laughs> Battle. Here we go, Water Gun. Boom! Destroyed it. Look at that. All right, beautiful. Scatterbug's level six. Also, doesn't Scatterbug evolve at seven? We're getting kind of close. Can I fight the Houndour? Oh, I don't think it's gonna let me. Oh no, level twenty. Ooh, I probably can't beat that yet. I'm gonna wait. I don't want to instantly lose. Maybe if I grind against these young goose, fight them first, then I might be able to beat it. But I want that bonus EXP for battling that Houndour. All right, Karoo Water Gun again. Level two. I'm surprised none of these are more than level two. Applewood's almost seven too. All right. Oh, we got a Diglett over there. Wait a second though. Aren't, aren't Wiglets like the, what just happened? What, what was that? My little guy was freaking out all over the place. We got a Diglett. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to fight him, but... Didn't want to auto-battle, but that's okay. What else is over here? Let's see. Because Dugtrio is obviously a really good Pokemon, so I kind of want that. By the way, that Houndoom was level 40 and not 20. Oh, well then, <laughs> I'm not even going to bother trying. Alright, this one's level 3. Let's see. Can you live this? Nope. Karu's too powerful. Killing everything. Alright, sorry, Karidon. I'm going off the beaten path. I'm looking for a bunch of other stuff. Alright. There's a bunch of Hound Hours. <laughs> we got you surrounded! <laughs> he said, get out of here! I'm a legendary! Leave! Let's see. Some pretty rough and rowdy Houndour there. I'm glad you got your bodyguard. Yeah, I want to catch a Houndour, though. I don't want him to chase all of them off. Now, let's see. Make our way up here. Let's see. Got some more. 
It straight up pulverized that rock. Just how powerful is that thing? I wonder what that move was. Okay. Something's coming. Ah, here's the Houndoom. Boom! Ooh, this is kind of funky. Hmm. Oh yeah, level 40. There's no way. You can't find an opening to swap Pokemon. That means poor little Karoo's gonna get pulverized. Use Crunch! Hmm? Ah, uh, here we go! <laughs> Knock him back! Here come all the little hound hour. <laughs> this is kind of cool, actually. I like this. We got you surrounded! like, it's okay, buddies. Come on. I just want to catch one of you. Yo! He... Oh, I thought he... St I thought he stopped on that one hound hour and straight up, like, killed the thing. He didn't. He didn't. He just jumped in front. The camera angle made it look like he killed that hound hour. I was like, we're getting kind of rowdy in this Pokemon game this time around. All right, but he got me. We're out of the cave. We're good. I'm happy he saved me. Way to go. For a second, I thought you were both goners. <laughs> I do want to go back in that cave and get a hound hour, though. All right. Hmm? He wore himself out. He needs another sandwich. Used up all its power. What kind of Pokemon is this anyway? It looks like a Cyclozar, but not one I've ever seen. And now it looks different from a minute ago. You think it's okay? Hard to say. Can't tell either, huh, Roger's base? Well, I'm seriously glad to have you back up here in one piece! She said it. You know, that battle down there was really something. You and this fellow looked perfectly in sync facing down that Houndoom. What? You didn't even tell it what to do? I guess it's not like you're this Pokemon's trainer yet, huh? One day. Don't worry. Looks like it perked up a little. Do you think this fellow was the one making that mysterious cry we heard before? Sure was. The more mysterious it seems, the more I look at this Pokemon. If you do become its trainer, you gotta let me battle against it. Sure thing. Let's exchange numbers so we can get in touch. You got it. Here's my Rotom phone. <laughs> and this will let you teach your Pokemon a move that will help it battle stronger opponents. Oh, Swift is always good. All right. Think before you use it, though, because TMs can only be used once. All right, so that's the case, too, then. They're not reusable anymore. Let's get to the lighthouse. That'll be a good spot to relax. You got it. Can I go back in that cave, though? I really do want a Houndour. No, okay. It says you maybe shouldn't go in there. Okay. It was worth a shot. Make our way back down here. Oh, you could make more. Fletchling. Where's Fletchling? Oh, I got another Scatterbug. Take him out. Very good, Kuru. No, I think that's everything for over here, then. Okay. Can't go down that cliff yet. Go back up to the lighthouse. Okay. I just like looking around everywhere. Anything over here? Oh, there's like a whole other area. I figure I'll get through this first, though. Okay. Why that little... Hmm? What are you doing out here? 
Oh, they know each other already? I'm not talking to you two. You could shove off. Yo, why are you being mean? Aren't you Arvin? You're enrolled in the humanities track. You're the son of that poke. Oh! He's their kid? Sada? Doesn't matter who my mom is. The real issue is what in the world this Pokemon's doing out here. And what is with the form it's in? I didn't realize he was Sada's kid. I like his theme too. Hmm. As it should be. I can't fight while it's like this. The form Coridon takes in battle is its true form. Coridon's its name? How do you know that? You can't go back in the lab, it's locked. I don't remember ever seeing you around. Given the uniform, you go to the academy too, though. Coridon isn't the sort of Pokemon any old trainer can hope to command. It's special. Alright. Special how? What sort of Pokemon is it? You think you're up to ordering Coridon around? Then how about I test your worthiness? Let's go! I'm ready! I got a full team! I've been feeling all, um, all out of sorts, so I'm gonna use this battle to blast the doldrums away. I'm ready! Yeah! <laughs> Pokemon Trainer Arvin. Yeah, I like his theme! He's got a little Squavit. I like Squavit. I want to catch one myself. It's got the Professor Layton music in there, too. Memories are leaving a bad taste in my mouth. Okay. Levels 5 Squavit. Talking a big game. And I got a critical hit. One shot for a little Squavit. Goodbye. Easy. <laughs> Here we go. Seems you know a thing or two about battle, huh? It's over. Super easy. <laughs> okay. Took a little while to load after that, but... That was awesome, Roger. I guess I was never going to stand a chance against someone using Pokemon I only just caught. But if you really think you can take Coridon off my hands, you're going to need this. The Pokedol... Wait! So he's already caught then! He's just straight up giving it to us! Coridon's Pokeball! This is so weird that they give you the Legendary this early! Obviously you can't use it in battle yet, that's gonna be something you probably unlock throughout the course of the game. But it's so bizarre that you already own the Pokémon! This early on! It goes to the key items, but still in all, it's... you have the Pokeball! Like, you can't use it, but still... You better actually show up for school! What a weirdo, bro. Alright, perfect. That Arvin guy definitely knows more than he's letting on. Next time, he and I are battling, and I'm gonna ring out some answers from him. But right now, we gotta climb the lighthouse. I can't wait to show you the view of our school. Sure thing, Nimona. Alright. See if there's anything back here. Yep, I knew there would be. I knew it! I just know how these games work. Alright, here we go. I'm also hearing a bunch of other Pokemon out there. Oh, that's just Hoppip. Is there a Squavit? Oh, Fletchling! I need a Fletchling. Good, 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 good. I need a female Fletchling, though. Is this a female Fletchling? Nope. Then I don't want it. Water gun. I need a female Fletchling to name it Amy Adams. Alright, get out of here. Here we go. Let's try another one. Let's see. Caught Fletchling off guard. Yeah, perfect. Alright, great. Pound. Please don't kill it, though. Please don't kill it. Don't kill it. 
Yes, good. Amy Adams hung in there. Good, 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 good. All right, Fletchling was caught. Beautiful. Now I want to put it on my team, though. The Tiny Robin Pokemon. Fletchling's date has been added to the Pokedex. Normally calm, but once it enters battle, its hormonal balance changes and becomes aggressive. All right, well, again. Same name as the Fletchling when I first caught it back in X and Y. And every game since. Amy... Adams, gotta have my talent flame. Okay, add to my party. Who are we gonna swap? Um, magic or Scatterbug? I'm gonna switch Magic for the time being, just because the other ones are new Pokemon, and Scatterbug obviously is gonna evolve really soon. So, all right, there we go. Perfect. Got the boxes. We're good to go. Little Fletchling. Perfect. And, oh, what's that? Oh, that's just another... That's another Lechonk. <laughs> here we go. Take this guy out of here. Water gun away. I was surprised by how many new dog Pokemon are added. I know of three new ones. Yeah, so I know there's Fido. And then I know there's a Dark type. And then I know there's also Grievard as well. So there's quite a few of them. Here we go. Take out Hop Up too. Alright. I saw Pozo is super popular. I saw fan art after the starters were announced. What what kind of Pokemon is Pozo? Alright, take out Hop Up. Here we go. Level three. Perfect. Alright, let's just go up to Lighthouse. Let's see. We can fight more later. Because I want the open world to open up. I want to go get everything else. All right. South Province, Area 1. I do love the fact that we can just go everywhere that we see. That is really cool. Going up that mountain later. Here we go. Cool. What's up? That's Mezagoza. That's the name of the town. Okay. That huge building with the Pokeball on it is our school. So you're like smack dab in the middle of the region then. It's going to be great even you in the same class, Roger. I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait to get back. We're going to get so much. All right. Mountains, forests, grasslands, beautiful nature stuff as far as the eye can see. And you know what's waiting for you over these natural spaces? Tons of Pokemon! Consider this me officially telling you, welcome to Paldea. But anyway, like you can see, it's a kind of hike to get to school from here. So we have a little town over there. Let's make it to Los Platos for starters. Alright. Vamos! Come on, let's go. Make our way down the lighthouse, go to the new town. Let's see. Nope, oh, Poco Path. Looking for new Pokemon along the way. Show me Smoliv. Oh, we got another battle? Sure, sure thing, I'll fight you. If you talk to a Pokemon trainer like me, it means we're gonna battle? Okay. Youngster Elian. Ooh! I like the trainer battle theme. This is pretty good. All right. Pokemon are strong, huh? They sure are. Alright, let's get some stuff. Oh, we got a berry over here. What's this? X defense? Oh, we got a Psyduck! I want to get a Psyduck. Come here. I already have a duck, but still. Just have a team full of ducks. Psyduck and Quaxley. 
Cloud Nine. All right. Ooh. The base drops as well. That's kind of nice. All right. Wing attack. Come on, Kuro. <laughs> All right, what's what's the name of Karoo's family in One Piece? Like, you know, they've got the Duckbill Squad or whatever. What are their names? Let's see, we got Karoo. And then Karoo's family. Let me search this. Let me see. The Super Spot Duckbill Troops. Yeah, Karoo, Stomp, Ivan X, Cowboy Bourbon Jr., Kentoros... Hikoichi and Matsuge. All right, so Bourbon Jr. is going to be the name of this Psyduck for sure. Got to catch him. Let's go. Mm. Mm. Psyduck, Bourbon Jr. <laughs> Look at this. Everybody's leveling up. All right, this is great. It is constantly racked by a headache. When the headache turns intense, it begins to use mysterious powers. Yeah, Bourbon Jr. Here we go. Whoops. Here we go. If there's other duck Pokemon that we run into, we can name them after the other Spotted Bill <laughs> duck characters from One Piece. All right, Bourbon Jr., add to your party. Uh, what's my party right now? No, I kind of I want to leave everything to my party right now. I'm gonna send it to my box. But I got him. <laughs> I'm excited to go look at the Pokedex and see all the little pictures too. Look at all the stuff over here. Let's see. It's just weird that you could go literally anywhere. I love it. All right, we got more Hoppips, more Scatterbugs. So these are more like basic Pokemon in this route. Antidote. Let's see, I'm going to heal my Amy Adams as well. There you go. Thank you, by the way, to James McKay for super chatting. Appreciate that. All right, we got a whole group of these guys now. Let's take out one of them. Come on, Quaxley. Very good. Very, very good. Come on, Quaxley. More of them. Take them all out. You got this. Very, very good. Come on, get that EXP multiplier. Let's go. You got this. You got this, buddy. Now I see what you guys are talking about when you're fighting a bunch of them. Oh, this one auto-battled. All right. Level 7, we got this. Come on, Karu. Water gun. I like the music in this game. There are later tracks that were made by Toby Fox that are jaw-dropping. I won't say more. I'm excited. Okay. Perfect, perfect. Echoed voice, very nice. We got another Fletchling. Something over here, what's this? Ooh, Endure! Okay, we got a TM. Very nice. Here, let's go down this way real quick. What's that? Oh, Fido! Oh no, Oracorio! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, I'm gonna switch. Wait. Change position. Here we go. Let's fight. Oracorio on the first route. Here we go. Echoed voice. I actually really like Oracorio. Because isn't this version electric flying? That's probably pretty good to have early in the game. I know I got Palmy, but still. All right, echoed voice. Perfect. Pokeball, here we go. Mm. Beautiful. Put that baby in the box. <laughs> Applewood just chilling in the front. This form of Oricorio has sipped yellow nectar. It uses nimble steps to approach opponents and then knocks them out with electric punches. No nickname for now. We're good. All right. Here we go. What? Oh, is that another Palmy? I won't fight him just yet. 
I want to find Smoliv. Oh, Fido, 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 Fido. I want Fido. I want a Fido. Here we go, the bread Pokemon. Look how cute he is. All right, echoed voice again. Come on, Applewood. I can make a sandwich with the Pokemon I'm gonna catch. I can have some bread with Fido, some bacon with Applewood, put some olive oil on it with Smoliv, I'm good to go. They got a whole sandwich theme team. <laughs> Obviously, you know what we're naming Fido, though. Okay. Here we go. Catching him. <laughs> beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Look at the little Fido run in the background, too. That's cute. Look how quickly Amy Adams is leveling up, too. Amazing. Charge. Yeah, I want to learn charge. Get rid of Growl. Okay. The puppy Pokemon. It's so smooth and moist to the touch. Yeast in Fido's breath induces fermentation in the Pokemon's vicinity. Of course. <laughs> Someone in the chat already got it. <laughs> Das Poop, you literally already knew what I was going to do. Obviously, my dog's name is Obi, and this dog's name is Fido, so we got to call it Fidobi. Obviously, we got to have Fidobi. Okay, who are we replacing? Um, See, I want Scatterbug to evolve. Also, there's an Iggly buff over there. Uh, what am I getting rid of? I, you know what? I'm going to do Scatterbug. Fido's a new Pokemon, so obviously we'd rather have Fidobi. Alright, you gotta put Obi in a bread costume now? Totally! We got a couple Iggly buffs over here, alright. Level 6 Iggly buff? We got it. Jack Lockwood also said, by the way, you can press X when learning a new move and the Pokemon will suggest what move to get rid of. Oh! Interesting. That's a cool new feature. I'm gonna catch this Iggly buff though. What's back there with the Psyduck? There's a lot of new Pokemon. All right. Bum 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 bum. Iggly buff was caught. Okay. Very good. Applewood leveled up as well. The balloon Pokemon. Its body has a faintly sweet scent, and it's bouncy and soft. No nickname for Iggly Buff, though. It's going in the box. All right, let's see. Man, there's a lot of Pokemon very early on. Oh, that's a trainer, I think. Here we go. Boom. <laughs> Fighting this little kid. Z Z what? Zahira? Zahira the student. Lechonk versus Lechonk. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna echo voice until I beat it. That's it. Spam an echoed voice. Man, I really genuinely have a taste for Subway sandwiches now, though. Like, I actually want to get myself a sandwich for lunch. I might do that. I have leftover DoorDash credits from when I did that Nintendo thing a couple days ago. I might actually get some sandwiches for lunch. I want to name Lechonk Inosuke when I see one. Oh, that's cute. We got another Fido over here. Hold on. I'm going to switch to Karu real quick. Switch. There we go. Fight all these Fidos. Poke Popopo says, check your Pokedex rewards. I will indeed. I'll check it right after this. I'll fight these Fido. Check my rewards. Then we got to go over there to the little town. Get some items. I'm just getting lost. I'm, I'm walking around, having fun traversing things, catching new Pokemon, boosting up the ones I already got, having a strong team. All right. Beautiful Fido fur. And see, there's like extra little stuff over here too. All right. Penn Station has my favorite sandwich place? Really? What's the name of the sandwich place? Got a Pokeball over here. See what else is over here. Another Pokeball. 
Oh, a Bleasel? Okay. Perfect. I'm gonna fight it with a wing attack. Boom. Oh, I accidentally killed it. Oh, well. Sorry, Bleasel. Next time, if only you were stronger. I'll oh, fight this hop too. Everything's over here anyway, so I'm like... I just want to fight everything and get experience. This really is the perfect stream game, I'm telling you. Because you could just get lost, explore the map, catch some new Pokemon, chill, talk to chat. All right. Let's see, let's see. What else do we have? Gotta hop it. All right. Here we go. My wife is in Chicago this week. Aren't you from there? I am indeed. And Master Luke says, no, no, that's the name of the sandwich place. It's called Penn Station. It's got hot East Coast sub sandwiches. Bro, I really genuinely want to order a sandwich right now. I, I think I'm going to do it. I really do. I think I'm going to do it. All right, wing attack. Let's go. Here we go. Take out the side up. Covet. Yes, I want covet. Get rid of Growl. Oh, it's got Lick, too. Cute. Okay. Here we go. Got some Psyduck down. What's that? What is that? Oh, Azuril. Okay, I'll catch one of these. Goat base with the goat streams. Enjoy the game. The graphics are tough, but it's fun nonetheless. Can't wait to play more tomorrow. Hey, right on. Well, welcome to the stream. Even if you're done playing for the day. Okay. I'll catch this Azuril. Boom. Filling up my Pokedex early. By the way, there's something under the bridge. Oh, I'll make sure to check it out. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, let's see. Whoa, what was going on there? The camera, like, cut through the ground or something? What was that? All right. Here we go. Got Mizuril. All right, check under the bridge for something. What is that? Oh! One of the little money guys? Grab a ghoul or whatever? Wait, is it not gonna let me fight him? Wait, 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 I want the little grab a ghoul. All right, hold on, let's fight this guy, then I wanna get grab a ghoul. You can't catch him, but make sure to press A on him. All right. Gimme Ghoul. It's not called Grab a Ghoul. Gimme Ghoul. Excuse me. Grab a Ghoul is a better name. I like Grab a Ghoul better. So I don't care if he's called Gimme Ghoul. I'm calling him Grab a Ghoul. Mm. Grab a Ghoul, let. Eh? I'm Italian. Grab a Ghoul. <laughs> All right. See, my last name's Di Luigi. I can say that. <laughs> hey, Grab a Ghoul. All right, let's take out the hop hip. <laughs> My Garchu's gonna level up soon. All right, now let's go under the bridge. Let's press A on this little guy. A Gimme Ghoul coin. Material accidentally dropped by a Pokemon. All right, great. Here we go. Now let's see. Can I fight? Oh, 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 we got more Fletchlings. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Come on, Karu, take them all out. Do your worst. Oh no, they didn't want to scatter. All right, here we go. Water gun again. I just find it so funny that it's a new Pokemon game filled with Pokemon that I've never seen before. And instead I'm still defaulting to Fletchling and Talonflame. <laughs> I just like Talonflame too much. I always have. All right, very good. Everybody's leveling up really nicely, though. All right. I know it's a Pokemon stream, but I'm genuinely curious. What would you like to see Oda do with Usopp's character in future arcs? Advanced observation hockey and meeting the giants in Elbeth. Easy. Fido's already level nine. Little Fido B. Beautiful. What's my Lechonk at? Probably almost level 10. Excuse me. All right. Perfect. Very good. 
Man, I feel like Gwen is leveling up really slowly. Oh, this is the same little kid that I uh, fought earlier. All right. Let me go back. Oh, I thought that was small of for a second. If you guys see a small of, tell me, because I definitely want one. Here we go. Little scatter bug over there. Another item. Town Flame's my favorite flying type. It is also one of my favorites. All right, so see, I'm just gonna send Quaxley off to go do his own thing over there. And then hopefully he keeps attacking some. Perfect. Like now, it's, I'm just gonna watch him from over here. All right, so he just fought a third one. And then now he's fighting the fourth one. I see him in the background, that's so cute. Just watch him waddling around fighting the other talent flames. <laughs> that's so cute. All right, here we go, here we go. We made it to the town, perfect. Oh, also, also, you guys said Pokedex rewards, right? I wanna go to the Pokedex. Here we go. How do I accept Pokedex rewards? I love that all of these little Pokedex entries have little images too, that's so cute. Makes the game feel a little bit like Pokemon Snap. Scatterbug. That poor Scatterbug's about to get eaten. Got Psyduck, Igglybuff, Fido, <laughs> Oracorio. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, look at this! Great! Got some Stardust. Perfect. All right, we're making good progress. I'm feeling great. Over here, you got it, Nimona. This is a Pokemon Center. Come here to take care of a lot of things related to your Pokemon. All right, keeping them healthy. Got the Pokemart, fantastic. To my right is a technical machine. TM for short, it's your ticket to making TMs. So you make them at the Pokemon Centers then, okay. You need to pay an LP and supply the machine with materials. Okay. She's giving me some money? Thank you very much. 6,000, I have 6,000 LP already? Great. In the Union Circle, you can connect with other trainers to find some adventuring companions, perfect. All right, here we go. By the way, don't forget to check out the new moves that Gwen learned. I saw it leveling up and learning a new move while you use the Let's Go feature. It learned, uh, it's the Scatterbug move. Isn't that what it's called? Bug Scatter or Scatterbug or something? Or Struggle Bug? All right. Are you ready? Then let's go. Send out your lead Pokemon with the R button. Okay, perfect. Pressing the R button is a quick and easy way to tell your lead Pokemon, let's go. You got it. Oh, you can pick up nearby items too, cool. Your Pokemon's low on energy and its HP is low, it won't be able to go exploring on its own, so if it gets weak, heal them. You got it. You got it. Easy. All right, easy, easy. Let's heal up. Heal my Pokemon. Also, it says that you can get a mystery gift flying Pikachu right now. I will definitely do that. Pretty, 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 pretty good. good. Thank you, James McKay. $10 donation saying, Roger, I have a question. If they make another Smash game, which Pokemon would you want in it? I would personally want Rayquaza, Scorch, or Gengar. Shouldn't even need to ask me that. Come on, lick a tongue all day, every day. Make his moveset based around the Sushi Go Round game from Pokemon Stadium. Give him Fire Blast, Blizzard, Thunder, and Body Slam. Call it a day. All right, tips on where you want to go next, got it. So now, okay, let's see, mystery gift. Can I register my birthday? Oh, okay. Birth month, 03, March 9th. There you go. That's right. Stop by on your big day, you got it. All right. Oh, I know. I know where to go. I just wanted to do the mystery gift thing. All right. TMs. Perfect. TM made exchange materials. Let's see. What TMs can I make? 
Whoa, whoa, you can make a lot of stuff. Mud slap, protect, side beam? Low kick, disarming voice. It's like I just started the game already, I could learn side beam? Low kick, fire fang, mud slap. Mud slap's actually a really good move. I'm gonna go with mud slap. Make one of those. And then I also want to get a... I'm going to teach Mudslap to fight Adobe. Tackle, Covet. Steals the item. Nah, let's get rid of that. It's fine. I'm not going to make any more yet. I'm good. Oh, actually, wait a minute. Let's go to the, the Mart as well. Hold on. Buy and sell. Let's see what we got. Pokeballs. I still have 12. I'm not worried about that. I'm not worried about any of that. I don't need to spend my money yet. Got this old lady over here. I'm assuming this is where you do the mystery gift thing, right? Oh, no. No, okay. I'm not doing any of this yet. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I don't want to form a group. I'm good. Not yet. Maybe this on the wall? Having fun? I'm having a lot of fun, Zeph. I am really enjoying myself. The Pokemon variety is really good. I keep getting lost. I keep going off the beaten path and doing other stuff. Oh, you can just like wander around the town and there's Pokemon here? What's going on over here? Our desserts will melt your heart. You want some ice cream? Sure. Meal powers. Okay. Item drop power, raid power, EXP point power? Interesting. So now my normal types are going to have more EXP? What? My little team? What? <laughs> okay. Cute. Catching power and water type went up. Humongo power for fire. I'm assuming that does more fire damage. And EXP points. Cool! That is really, really cool. Alright, so now obviously I gotta train my Latronk a little more. Let's see, I wanna find some more Pokemon over here. Get some berries and just look around. South Province Area 1. Got another Fido over there. There's a TM over there as well. You can now go anywhere except locations that your mount upgrades need. Anywhere? The map is now completely open? Fantastic. Stored power? Dude, this is so good! I can literally go wherever I want. This is fire. Dude, I genuinely, I love this already. By the way, Roger, your food perks only last 30 minutes. All right, so I gotta fight. I gotta fight. I gotta fight then. All right. Water gun, we'll fight these guys, get some extra experience, boost my Lechonk. We're good. All right. By the way, Roger, you already have Mystery Gift, you just need to connect online to get it. See, but I don't want people invading my game yet, so I'm not gonna bother. I'll wait, I'll wait. All right, take out this Iggly Buff Water Gun. Very good. Good work, Karoo. Amy Adams is level 10. What level does Fletchender evolve? Or Fletchling evolve? Is it like 14 or 16 or 18? Alright. Come on, Karoo. <laughs> I don't think people can invade. Oh, you just set yourself online? Oh, then I might do that. If you go southwest from the town, you'll find the Flamingo and Paul Day and Wooper. Oh, I want both of those. This isn't Dark Souls, Roger. <laughs> That's true. I My brain's rotted from Elden Ring. So <laughs> okay. Level 17 is when Flitchinder evolves. Perfect. Good to know. More Fido's over here. All right. I don't want to catch these guys yet. I want to go get the Flamingo. And I want to get Paul Day and Wooper. So southwest from here. But 
but there's all these other areas I want to go to. It's like, wait, I don't even know, like, where to start, really. It's cool. Okay. Got some people all over the town. Okay. Is that a TM over here? South Province Area 1. Okay. If you find bodies of water, you'll find Paul Day and Whooper. Good to know. Got another TM. What's over here? Oh, squab it! I want to squab it! I specifically want a shiny one, though. The shiny ones are super cute. Alright, pound. Easy, we'll catch a squab it. Just don't kill it. You're good. I do really like the funky bass in the battle theme. It's great. Alright, squab it. You're getting caught. Even though you're going right in the box. Because you're not a shiny one. <laughs> Sup, Roger? How's the duck doing? Karoo's doing fantastic. He's carrying the squad right now. All right. Perfect. Got this. The cheeky Pokemon. <laughs> it will stuff pebbles into its chief to stave off cravings. How cute. All right. Now let me see. I'm going to go southwest from here. Here we go. I want to get my Poldean Whooper. Here we go. More of Province 1. I want to get that Flamingo as well and name it Dofi. What? What was that? What's that? What's that? A Palmy? Oh, hold on. We got an item over there too. This is also so peaceful. Just walking around and grabbing stuff. Finding Pokemon, exploring with your friends. It's cute. Are those more Squavits over there? It seems like it. Oh, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Uh-oh. I scrambled back out of the water. I didn't mean to do that. Here we go. What is that? What is that? Wait, what is this thing? What the heck is this supposed to be? Shrudel? Is that supposed to be like a, graf a Grafifi baby? Shrudel? Yeah, let's catch it. It is, it's Grafifi's pre-evo, okay. The only reason I thought it was Grafifi is because it has the weird tongue and the weird eyeballs. Shrudel? And Shrudel Ink, the toxic mouse Pokemon. Though usually a mellow Pokemon, it will seek its sharp, poison-seek, po ah, poison-soaked front teeth into any that anger it, causing paralysis in the object of its ire. I am probably not going to use that thing yet, but I will see its summary. Poison normal. That's a cute-looking weirdo. But I'm probably not going to use him right now. All right, here we go. Put him away. A little shrewd all. All right, let's keep walking around. Here we go. Whoa, oh, oh, oh! Oh, that was Mimikyu. Oh, that's Pichu! Wait a minute! Pichu! All right, don't kill it. Don't kill it, Karu. Water gun, don't kill it. Let me catch him. Yes! Woohoo! Good. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. I'm catching Pichu. Good. Catching him. Beautiful. And I know what I'm naming him, obviously. Easy. Alright, I'm naming him Sakurai. Unskilled at storing electric power, any kind of shock causes it to discharge energy spontaneously. Here we go. Sakurai it is. Also, while I'm nicknaming this Pikachu, I'm gonna go get some water and run to the bathroom real quick.
who's been streaming for a little while now. We've already been streaming for two hours. I'm planning on going for a long time. So, like, sit back and relax. Don't worry, I'm not going anywhere. But I got to go to the bathroom real quick. And I got to get some more water. And I want to grab a snack. So give me a second. We'll be right back. I have returned. All right, let's do this. Boom. I got my new thing of water. I got an ice drink. I'm good. Did you see the video that Sakurai just posted about his cat? Of course I did. Of course. I follow everything Sakurai related. Of course. <laughs> okay, here we go. Man, I forgot how good these are. These strawberry ices. Okay, here we go. Yo, Ice, sponsor me, please. I like your stuff. All right, add to your party. Uh, no, I'm gonna send them into the box for now. There's too many other good ones, and we got Palmy, and I wanna evolve Palmy. Though Pichu is very cute. All right, now, where were we going? Hold on, wait, let me look at my map. Cause southeast of, oh, 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 oh there's Bone Sweets. Southeast of here, this is like where you get the flamingos, right? So do I want to go here? Here, set his destination. Here we go. More little squavets. How's the game so far? I am seriously having a blast. It is really, really fun. I just like being able to go wherever you want and like how peaceful it is. It is a perfect stream game. Because we can kind of do whatever we want. We, we're not like rushing through story stuff or anything. We're just kind of catching Pokemon and leveling them up and just having a good time. Well, there's a whole other area over here too. Hold on. What a cool Pokemon. Well, I'm going to beat you. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Choodle. Here we go, Karoo. You're doing great. Hang in there, buddy. Water gun. <laughs> Thank you, by the way, to all the new subscribers and all the members today as well. This is fantastic. Hamza going, me and Roger are never going to choose the same Pokemon? Oh, what do you mean? <laughs> all right, here we go. Perfect. Palmy's 10. Looking cool just doesn't cut it. All 
right. Now let's see. I'm gonna grab this berry. More hop-ups over there. Oh, I'm not gonna worry about them. I wanna go the other direction. And get the flamingo. Dude, there's so many hop-ups. I can't get over that. Maybe. Oh, you know what I could do? Here, I could do this. Because Amy Adams is the lead, right? And she's fire flying, so she could just take out all these guys and get a bunch of experience. There you go. There you go, Amy Adams. Very nice. Come here. Here, come on. Fight them all. Look at this. She's doing great. Beautiful. All right. Grab one of these little potions. Got another trainer over here. Got some hop ips. Got some of these little spider guys. Here you go. Where's she going now? Oh man, she really she likes picking fights. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> okay. Look at this. And everybody's just leveling up in the background while I'm walking around. This is so nice, man. And it tells you in the corner the last thing that happened. 14, 7. So, like, after beating this one, what's it going to be? All right. We're going to go over here. Let's fight this guy. I love that you completely skipped the tutorial to get your ride for now. Oh, yeah, I don't care about that. I just like walking around. Watching Roger on the big screen playing the game on the smaller screen. Hey! By the way, you guys really do seem to like the new visual layout, which makes me very, very happy. All right, Amy Adams, I should probably switch you out. That Shinx is definitely going to spark. All right, switch. Let's bring in... Fidobi, because Fidobi's got mud slap. Hamza said, Roger, you choose cute and cuddly Pokemon and I choose the sick looking ones? <laughs> hey, that's fair. I like cool ones. I like the cuddly ones as well, though. I also think it's funny when you're battling these like really powerful trainers with cute little guys, with just silly little dudes. It makes me very happy. <laughs> All right, Fido, come on. Keep it up, buddy. I also like that you could look around with the camera. I guess that probably is what causes some of the weird glitches that people had, but I don't mind. Let's look how cute Fido me is. I can't get over it. <laughs> Perfect, nine. I am curious, do you guys know what level... Um, the spider thing evolves? Feel free to tell me because then I want to figure out whether or not I should keep it on my team right now or not. Here, let's go this way. Scatterbug. Oh, there's like a fence over here. Okay. Interesting. How do I get over the fence? Do I have to have my ride Pokemon, I'm imagining? Let's see, because I imagine I can't climb. Let's see, do you have a team you're uh, in mind that you want to use? Not really, not yet. I'm kind of leaving it up to what I like using, just naturally. We got a berry over here, fantastic. I know obviously I'm going to keep Quaxley on my team, but everything else is kind of up in the air. I'm probably Talonflame too. I always like having Talonflame. Another Squavit. Take that guy out, Amy Adams. Thank you very much. Go over here. Hmm, maybe I need, to, in order to get to where I need to go, maybe I need my ride Pokemon to get to the Flamingos and the Whoopers and stuff. Rare candy already? Seems kind of early in the game for rare candies, but I'll take it. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Take them all out. Okay. Oh, what's over there, too? Got a TM. Struggle bug. Very good. 
I'm assuming I can't jump off the cliff. Oh, Bonsly! Okay. I'll get a Bonsly. Wait, let me switch my Pokemon before I fight him, though. Or no, I don't want to do that. Wait. Uh, Fidobi. There you go. Dude, I love... I love that thing where you press the Y button and it swaps them from the position into the first position instead of going through Switch and clicking another thing. That's such a minor change, but I love that. All right, Bonsly. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna catch this little guy. Woo! Bonsley was caught. Perfect. <laughs> I already know what I'm gonna name it too. The Bonsai Pokemon, in order to adjust the levels of fluids in its body, it exudes water from its eyes. It makes it appear to be crying. Yep, I'm gonna give it a nickname. Miyagi-Do. There we go. Whoops. Boom. There we go. Miyagi-Do. But I'm not gonna use it. For now. Maybe I'll use it later. It's also a lie. I'm not going to. I don't even know why I'm giving you hope. Sorry, Bonsley. But I needed you for the Pokedex. Alright, how do I get back down there? Oh, there we go. There's a berry over here, too. Alright. Let's see. We got more of the tarantulas, more Pichus. Oh, that's more of the tarantulas. There we go. Good work, Fidobi. I like that you can go pretty far away, too. Alright, let's go this way. Because you guys said southwest is where you find the flamingos. And I definitely want a flamingo. Okay, here... I'm assuming you have to walk through this little... Oh, 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 no. Okay, this doesn't open up, but there's good stuff over here. Okay. Revive. Metal Claw. Cool. And Full Heal. I don't know what on my team can use Metal Claw yet, but... Dude, the music is seriously so relaxing. I like it. Tyler said, how's performance so far? I wanted to get it, but everyone's saying the frame rate's unstable. There are definitely like weird little glitches and weird bugs, but it certainly has not hindered my enjoyment as of yet. I will let you know if that changes, but right now it's like, I'm just having fun exploring the world. Is that a male or a female combi? Hold on. Cause how do I, how do I aim at ZL to aim, right? Also, I think that was a male combi, so I'm not going to worry about it. Alright, so, oh, there's the water, too. You guys were saying the water's where you get the flamingos. Okay. Try to remember where you find the TMs, too, because they respawn after a while. That is good to know. Very good to know. Maybe I can make little notes of it on the map. Though, who am I kidding? The map of the entire game is going to be on Serebii probably in like one hour. Where every TM that's in the game is probably going to show up on that map instantly. If I have any questions, I could go on Serebii. Oh, here's the water. Okay. Oh, Flamingo! There we go! Here we go! Oh, I love it! Okay, okay. Flamigo! Now, this one's a female one. I want to catch a male one, and I want to name it Dofi. So obviously, I'm not using this Flamigo. I'm going to catch another one. I like him, though. <laughs> Flamigo! My Flamingo Amigo. <laughs> Copycat, what? Okay. Okay. 
Flamigo fainted, no problem. I'll catch another one. Oh yeah, see there's a bunch of them. I wonder what the shiny one looks like. Also, oh, Whooper! Paldean Whooper, man, I'm getting a whole bunch. Okay, this is great. Now he's poison ground, so I could use Mud Slap. Do a little bit of damage. Won't be, su yeah, there you go. Super effective, but it won't kill him. Perfect. Mud Slap again. Perfect. And I'll catch him. I do really like Paldean Whooper. I think he's funny looking. All right, Pokeball. Boom, there's a whole bunch of them over here too. Okay. Whooper was caught. Excellent. Everyone's leveling up quick. The Poison Fish Pokemon, Paldean Form Whooper. After losing a territorial struggle, Whooper began living on land. The Pokemon changed over time, developing a poisonous film to protect its body. I'm not going to nickname him. Whooper's too cute of a name. <laughs> oh, look how cute he even looks on the Pokedex entry. All right, come on, Flamigo. Be a male. Male Flamigo, come on. Please. Please. Ah, oh, man. All right, Pokemon, we're going to swap again. I'm going to swap in Garchu. Because I haven't used one yet. Okay. Paldean Whooper is the first poison ground since Nidoking King and Nidal Queen. That is very true. Copycat's not gonna work. All right, come on, Palmy. I can't get over how tiny Palmy is too. All right, double kick. So I'm assuming this thing's water fighting type. Here we go. Thunder Shock again. All right, static. Garchu's got this. I'm not too worried. Come on, Garchu. Okay, Flamigo fainted. Perfect. Oh, I just realized, too. I should heal up Garchu. Nah, I'm not going to do it right now. Don't worry about it. Garchu's fine. But what I will do... Because he only seems to be using... Um, fighting moves is I'm gonna switch oh Choodle okay I'll get one of these guys too oh he's flying fighting actually oh I like that that's good that can find a place on my team then I like that a lot flying fighting very interesting all right come on out Karu are you going to use a full team of new mons? Not necessarily. We're going to see who I end up liking using. Choodle's definitely going to get boxed, though. I'm going to catch one and immediately put it away. <laughs> there you go. I also like that you see the other Pokemon on the field while you're fighting and battling. What's like all of a sudden they'll just like enter the battle or chill around you. It's cute. All right, come on. I see another Flamigo back there, too. Yeah, I don't care about you, Choodle. That's fine. I only care about you for the TCG. All right, here we go. Here we go. Please. Male Flamingo. Please, please, please. The first one I get that's male, I'm catching. The very first one. But I can't move forward until I get a Dolphy. Let's go! Okay, don't kill it. Amy Adams, don't kill it. Don't kill it. Let's go. That's good. And he was in the orange. He wasn't even in the red. That means he's got some pretty nice stats, probably. All right, here we go. Pokeball. Pokeball go. Yes. 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 Flamigo was caught. Fido. Fido leveled up as well, too. The synchronized Pokemon. This Pokemon apparently ties the base of its neck into a knot, so the energy stored in its belly does not escape from its beak. Interesting. The synchronized Pokemon. I really like his design, too, of course. Real original, I know, but still. 
Ah, you know what? I'm just I'm not even calling him Dofi. I'm going all out Go Flamingo. Do Flamingo. Beautiful. Add to your party. I'm going to remove. The bug apparently evolves at 15, but like, it's not even leveling up that much. I'm, I'm switching. I'm sorry, Gwen. I'm sorry. Maybe your evolve form is cute, but I don't care. I want the flamingo. Okay. Now, anything else that's new over here? Actually, you know what I should do? Let me heal. Let me heal. Let me heal. There we go. And let's... Actually, hold on, wait, that's, uh, ground fighting, right? Amy Adams, honestly, I'm just, I'm sending you out to do everything. Just fight a bunch of these guys, and I'm looking for stuff. Looking for other new Pokemon or something. The Psyduck over there. Is there anything over there? No? Here we go. Oh, there's more of these flamingos over here. What else is over here? We got Palmy. Oh, Magikarp, Magikarp. We gotta get a Magikarp. Here we go. Wait, what, 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 what? Wait, 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 wait. He was waiting for me. All right, peck away. Don't worry about the spider. You can always catch his evolved form in the wild too. And just a heads up, you're gonna find it hard to want to go to the school when you get to the town because it's really big. Don't get lost in the town, for real, it's really easy to. Good to know. Very good to know. Alright, Flamigo's getting caught. We are good. He's already level 8. Fantastic. Let's see, any goodies over here I need to know about? I'm assuming I can't go in the water at all yet. I probably have to have my ride Pokemon before I can do that. So we won't do the rest of this area, but I did want my Flamigo. Oh, there's like a Ruins over here. Wait. Oh, Drowsy? Okay. Let's see. I'll catch one. Peck was revealed to be a move that Amy Adams knows. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> How does shiny hunting work? Apparently, you see shinies in the wild now, which is kind of cool. Can you do a treble impression? I got you. No, baby! <laughs> there you go. All right, drowsy. Beautiful. Play something with mud shot, absolutely. Let's replace tail whip with mud shot. Beautiful. All right. Drowsy, definitely not using that. Here we go, at least not for right now. Man, I feel like I am filling up my Pokedex quick this time around. There's just so much stuff so early. More of these flamingos. Oh, we got a trainer over here. Let's beat this trainer. By the way, Roger, make sure to check the ruins. There's a gimme ghoul in there. I will definitely do it. Poof said he already has 88 mods. There's so many to catch everywhere. Oh, oh, wait, what, wait, what is that thing? That's the Pompadour Parakeet thing? Squawkabilly? Oh, like Rockabilly. <laughs> Squawkabilly. That's kind of cute. I like the name. <laughs> this game is crazy. I had a whole team planned out everywhere you look, but yeah, you should definitely just do what you want to do. And Beautiful Joe Star says, I want to get into Pokemon, but I don't know where to start. Just start with this one, Beautiful Joe. There's no better time than now. Start with this one. Join us. <laughs> All right, Amy Adams, come on. Beautiful. A vision. Learn detect. Nuzzle? Yes, I want to learn Nuzzle. Let's replace Scratch with Nuzzle, because we already have Quick Attack, which is literally a better Scratch, so... 
Okay. Just what could be behind that? Whoa! Wait, I lost? I think I didn't even know what was going on here. Alright. Give me ghoul in the ruins, apparently. Let me look around for it. Give me ghoul. A lot of flamingos. Here, I'll just let Amy Adams do some damage while I'm looking for other stuff. Oh, there he is! Give me ghoul! Perfect. Got a coin. I'm gonna have him fight some drowsy while I'm going over here. Let's see. Something over there. Oh, is that another gimme goal? There's two of them over here. I got a second one. All right. Five gimme goal coins. Okay. Look at all these drowsies, by the way. Like, what in the world? Why are there so many drowsy? <laughs> I mean, she's getting good experience for the whole team, but jeez. Here, let's go up this way. What else is over here? Something maybe hidden over here? No. That's just a cliff to get down. Seems like there's a TM over there. Got some more of these little guys. More Lechonks. So this is just like a way over the mountain. Oh, what's the, what's over there? A hidden doorway and an extra TM? Oh, a peeny! Yo, hold on, I might I might want to catch one of these. Blissey is always useful. Alright, Happini. Heck away. Okay. Here we go. Catch this. I just think it's so funny seeing the little sweat beads coming off of a chonk every time you go around the corner. <laughs> Alright, Epini, you got this. Doflamingo's already level 10. Excellent. The Playhouse Pokemon, okay. Check out all of these later. Get one of these. Psy Beam, cool. I don't think anything that I have can use that yet. There's another TM though. Acid Spray, okay. Man, maybe I really should go get my, um, Coridon, my ride Pokemon. Because I feel like there's a lot of stuff that I'd want to explore, but I can't do it yet. Here, we got a potion over here. Yeah, I want to know what this is. Faint writing is carved into the shrine. Herein lie sealed the ruinous tablets. Maybe that's like a spirit tomb thing or something? I don't know. I can always come back here. Okay, get this guy. Paralyze heal. Got another scatter bug, fight him. Yeah, cause see there's obviously a lot of items over here. Got some scatter bug powder, EXP candy. Something's up there too. All right. Paw me. There's another gimme ghoul. I see him. I'm glad I walked up here. Perfect. All right, so I can't jump from this height. Good to know. There we go, fight more of these guys. I am so curious what the shiny of the flamingo is going to look like. <laughs> Psyduck's just wandering in the background. <laughs> Has he gone to school yet? I haven't even gone to the school, I haven't even done the first gym. I'm just having fun exploring. I really, I haven't done anything really yet. Alright, we should probably make our way over there though. 
Here, I'll remove the destination thing from my map. Because that's, uh, the map is... Start or minus? Minus is the Pokedex. X is this. Okay, talking. You have R. Is the let's go. Can't use emotes, that's right. Whoops. It just, it's gonna take me a little while to remember what the buttons were for all the hotkeys. Again, X is the menu. That's emotes. That's camera. Okay. Back, let's go back. Yeah, what is the, uh... Does anybody know the button to pull up the map again? Just so I could take the map thing off? Y, thank you! It's Y button, okay. Yeah, I'll remove this. I don't need this anymore. There we go. That's something that I'll just get used to with time. It's not a big deal. Okay. Now we gotta make our way back. All the stuff in the background. Alright, scatterbug powder. Here you go, paralyze heal. And then what level is everybody at? Right now, Amy Adams is 14. Karoo's 15. Fidobi's 14. I want to get Flamigo up a little bit. Let me go to the bag. Let's do... Because don't I have, like, EXP stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Before I do that, wait, 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 wait. 100? Oh, it just picks up where you left off? Ooh, good. Okay. Great. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to do that. All right, wing attack. Let's get rid of Peck. Very good. Use this on Flamigo. Fantastic. All right, let's go. Then let's see. Auto heal again. Amy Adams and Fidobi. I'm going to switch. I'm going to switch to a Flamigo to the front just because I want to start using him in battle a little bit. Even things out. We are going to head to the school. I'm gonna get my ride Pokemon. Here we go. Yeah, I just, man, it really is nice. Like, I know things look kind of basic and people were complaining about the performance or whatever, but actually, like, when you're playing the game, it looks nice to me. It's not bothering me that much at all. And, like, there have been hiccups now and then, but we haven't run into any major issues. There was that one weird camera clip. All right. I'm going to heal while I'm here, too. Ba -da -da -da. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There we go. I like my little team so far. All right. Did you know? Oh yeah, my emotes, I knew that. All right, thank you. We're going off to the school now. We're going off to the school. Sure does take a lot of walking to get around here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see what else we've got. On the lookout for any other weird looking Pokemon that are over here. Oh, see, I'm glad I walked over here. See, there was a TM that I didn't get. Special defense. Is that Surskit? Oh, I want to catch a Surskit. Uh. There we go, there we go, there we go. Can I not fight them yet? Wait. Come here. There's gotta be a way to do it. Hold on. Or 
Let's see. Come here. Let's see. No? Alright. Apparently you can't catch them in the pond yet. I got it. Okay. I will wait. I'll wait till I get my little ride guy. We'll make our way back up here. I should also see what TMs I have. And teach my Pokemon some TMs before I go to the first gym and go to the school and everything. We got another trainer over here I can fight. Heading to school, I sure am. Let's fight. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. All right, gulp. Let's see this. Flamigo. Wing attack. 13 versus level 5 Gulpins. <laughs> I really like his look. Also, I realize half of my team is birds right now. Alright, let's see. I got a Cherry Berry. Pokeball. Antidote. Here we go. What's that? Scatterbug? Not gonna worry about that right now. What is that? A Lechonk? Okay. I'm gonna get another Shrudel actually. Because they're poison normal, right? Normal is just... Right, okay, okay. I wanted to see that. I wanted to see if fighting is still super effective against poison normal. It's not. It's effective. Because poison resists fighting. So now... Fighting does neutral damage to him. Okay. Got another guy over here to fight. Let's see. Skylander says, nice layout. Thank you very much, Skylander. Appreciate it. We worked hard on finding just the right layout for the playthrough, so I'm glad you're enjoying it. Alright, Rookadee. <laughs> Here we go. Unnerve. Double kick. Beautiful. Pokemon was hit two times, and Rookity fainted. <laughs> Amy Adams learned Flail. Beautiful. Amy Adams is close to evolving, I think. Like you guys said, I think Fletchinder is 17. I like it. Okay, we got another Pokemon Center. Been having nice battles. Who are you? A Pokemon League rep. If you can defeat four trainers in Area 1 of the South Province, it's a lovely prize. I've defeated seven, so give me some stuff. Ooh, Thunder Wave. That's good. That's kind of cool. I like that. That there's little challenges for each of the areas, and the more trainers you fight, you get bonus items. It's cool. Okay. I also want to see really quickly... Oh, locking on ZL, right. I want to see my TMs. Because I know I got a bunch of them. Already. Let's go over here. TMs. Psybeam. Confuse Ray. Nothing can... Confuse Ray is really good. But nothing can learn it yet. Metal Claw. Palmy can learn. But I want to save it. Swift is good. I think I want to teach Swift to Karoo instead of Pound. And actually, I want to teach Swift to Amy Adams as well. I just like Swift. It's a good move. All right. Especially early on in the game. Thunder Wave. Rest. All right. I'm going to hold off on Thunder Wave for now. Okay. All right. Let's go. Finally made it.
Oi, Roger! Hmm? Did you battle some trainers on the hill? Bet your Pokemon are stronger. Show me all you learned in a battle? I'm about to destroy poor Nimona. <laughs> she is gonna get wiped. I have a full team of six and everyone's looking pretty good right now. Let's see. Challenged by Pokemon Trainer Nimona. We got Fue Coco, and I got Do Flamingo. <laughs> Dolphy! I'm coming at you with two Pokemon. Oh, wow. However, will I survive? Get him, Dolphy. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Round. It's kind of interesting. Here we go. Gonna send out Palmin. You wanna switch? Yeah, I'll switch. Send out Applewood. And use Mudshot. Because Palmy is electric, and Applewood is a ground type move, and ground is super effective against electric. The more you know. That door looks like it's at a hunter hunter. <laughs> it does a little bit. Like the, <laughs> the door to Zoldek Manor. <laughs> That's pretty good. I immediately knew what you were referencing. Your ace in the hole. All right, what are you going to do? Oh, Terra Stall? It's not going to matter. He's got the big light bulb on his head. That poor Palmy is still going to get wiped. <laughs> All right, let's see it. Thundershock. <laughs> Here we go. One more. You got this, buddy. You really work your tight matchups. I can tell how badly you want to win. She said, why are you being a tryhard? <laughs> Look, we don't have time for you, Nimona. I want to explore. All right. There goes Pommy. I kind of like the Terrasol effects, actually. It looks really pretty. Okay, made our way through. Dun, da, da, dun, da, da. I can't believe how fast you are at improving. Okay, here we go. Have some revives, thank you very much. I'm sure we're probably going to learn how to tear stall when we go inside the school. Or the first gym. To be honest, though, I don't even need i don't need it right now. I'm good. Koya says, wow, you're still live? Yeah, I mean, it's only been three hours. It's a new Pokemon game. What, you thought I was going to stream for, like, two hours today? Absolutely not. This doesn't happen every day. We got to enjoy a launch day Pokemon stream. Plus, I'm going to be streaming a bunch tomorrow. Also, for anybody who wants to catch it live... Tomorrow's part of the Pokemon playthrough is going to be on Twitch because I'm going to be on the front page of Twitch because Pokemon Company was very kind and put my name in there. So we're going to be streaming the second part of the playthrough on Twitch tomorrow, but it will be uploaded immediately afterwards to YouTube just to let everybody know. It'll be on YouTube afterwards. So if you're like, oh man, I can't make the Twitch stream, don't worry, it'll be up on YouTube later that day. Don't you worry about a thing. I remember the five, six hour playthroughs of Sword. Oh yeah, yeah, my Pokemon streams always go on a long time. Cause it's, it's just fun. All right, here we are. Here we go. You need to be careful not to over level since only uh, by defeating a gym will your Mons obey you past level 25. Oh, I don't think I'm going to over-level anytime soon. I'm only at, like, level 13. We're good. We got the first city of the game. Look at this. I remember seeing this for the first time in the initial trailer earlier this year when we found out, oh, we're getting a new generation of Pokemon. 
and not fully realizing at that point that it was completely open world. This is Mezagoza, the biggest city in Paldea. It's been a big trade hub since a long time ago. Folks come to learn about the advances in technology and all kinds of other stuff. There's a hair salon where you can change your look, places with tasty food and fixins. I still, like I said, I really badly want a sandwich. I think I'm gonna get that for dinner tonight. What do you want to see first? Tasty food! Didn't have you pegged for a big eater. But that's smart. You can't battle with a growling tummy, right? Alright, speaking of battling, I want to be sure you're able to terrestrialize your Pokemon. There's a few things that gotta get done before that happens, but I'll take care of them. Meanwhile, you just have fun looking around the city a bit. There's so much to do. Grab a bite, buy some accessories, to spice up your uniform. Oh, we could change our clothes already? If you want my personal recommendation, you have to see Deli Bird Presents. They sell handy held items. Oh, held item store! Okay! Okay, let's do this! Head to the school gates. Welcome, welcome. Hey, hello, Bronzong. Okay, well, hold on. Deli Bird presents. If I zoom in on the map, is it gonna tell me? Baggins. Wow, look at all these different stores. Rough and tough, Chansey Supply. Deli Bird presents, here we go. I know it's probably Deli Bird Presents, but I like Deli Bird Presents more. Though, I guess if it's supposed to be this, then... <laughs> Maybe it is supposed to be Presents instead of Presents. Alright, here we go. What a cute little design. Alright. Battle items, general goods, Rotom, Rotom phone cases? Oh, cute! I'm gonna go with the Quaxley one. Pay with LP. There we go. Put that on my Rotom phone. And then apparently they have held items, so battle items, okay. Oh. Ooh! You get all of this this early? Quick Claw this early in the game. Ability Shield. Shields the holder from having its ability changed. Ooh, that's interesting. Mystic Water, okay. And Sharp Beak. Actually, I'm gonna get a Muscle Band. Oh no, I can't. Then I'll get a Mystic Water. Okay. And then let's see. Bag. Let's give... Um, what do I want to do? Let's give Quick Claw. Whoops. Give Quick Claw to... Amy Adams, give Mystic Water. Whoops. Give to Carew. And then I can sell the Stardust, right? So I'll just sell the Stardust right now, too. Here we go. General Goods. Oh, Soothe Bell, Everstone. Bulk Buy. Ah, I'm good then, I'm good. Have the Delhi best day. Okay, let's see. Look at our map again. Let's see, we got the Academy to go to. Artisan Bakery. Sure Cans. Mezagoza West. Okay. Wow, this is a pretty big city. Can I go over here already? I don't know. I'll go inside the academy. I'll go up here. There we go. Come on out, Flamingo. Walk with me. I 
like Do Flamingo. He's cute. <laughs> They have like a little stage area over there, all right. Make our way up to the school. Yeah, the game really is chill. Much more chill than I was anticipating. And that is absolutely a good thing. Cause then I don't feel like I have to rush through anything. I could just take my time and enjoy myself. Oh, Penny. Get Penny off the screen. Get this Todoroki looking My Hero Academia loving kid off my screen. I didn't like Penny when I first saw Penny. I don't like Penny now. Maybe, maybe Penny's personality will make me change my mind. Maybe Penny's personality is going to be great. But right now, not a fan. Let's see. Walk it away. I'm not dealing with Penny right now. Oh, you have to deal with Penny to get to the school? All right, I guess. Ah. Uh, I wanted to walk away. All right, we'll help her out. You want in on this too? Well, if you're here to sign up, we'll get you next. We've nearly got this one in the bag. We're Team Star, kid. We burn so bright it hurts to look at us. But you knew that, right? Yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> we can't let something like this slide. The honor of our team's on the line, so we got no real choice but to battle, yeah? I also do like the Team Star team. She's cool. Okay, let's go. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh! I like their theme a lot! Oh, it was over too quick though! I couldn't hear the theme! I'll let it play out during the next time I get a Team Star battle. <laughs> I like it so far though. Why is it nobody like you so good at battling? It's only because you had a level 8 Pokemon. He beat you? Does that mean I gotta battle this kid now since I'm higher up in Team Star ranks? Of course. Pero bueno, what do you think you're doing? <laughs> the student council dweeb? <laughs> you don't have to find randos to battle. You have all the battles you ever need with me. Uh, that's not really what happened, but... <laughs> they picked a fight with you? I read that way wrong. Sorry. I get it now. You two have Team Star written all over you for sure. That you were trying to pressure people into signing up again, weren't you? Ah, uh, we're not doing that. <laughs> Roger, your Spanish sounds Italian? Cause that's my last name is Di Luigi. Pero bueno. <laughs> As head of the student council, stopping this type of nonsense would normally be my job. But this is also the perfect chance for you to try my amazing ultra rare gift to you. Terrastall stone, Terrastall ball. The Terra orb, here we go. All right, excellent. I'm pretty sure your Flamigo will be a flying type. Now normally you've gotta take special classes to be able to get one of these Terra orbs, but I put in a good word for you. All right, let's give it a whirl, I'm ready. I'm curious what the the flying type thing is gonna look like. Is maybe it's just balloons? Cause that's what's on the Pikachu. <laughs> Alright, let's battle. Cause now we know the electric one is a little light bulb. I know the normal one's a giant diamond. Okay. Young goose. Alright. E Z. Here in the Paldea region, Pokemon can crystallize through a strange phenomenon. They call this Terra Stalling. When a Pokemon terrestrializes, its type changes to its Terra type. Moves of the same type as this Terra type will be much more powerful. And after terrestrializing, you won't be able to terrestrialize again until you heal at a Pokemon Center. Alright. Well then guess what? 
I guess I have to, but... Alright, here we go. Terrasilize Wing Attack. Let's just see what it looks like. Go Flamingo! It's time! Dolphy! <laughs> he looks so goofy with the little balloons on his head. <laughs> Alright, let's go. <laughs> I mean, we decimated that young goose. <laughs> All right, perfect. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I actually kind of like their outfits more than the regular outfits. All right. You pulled off terrestrializing, no problem. Moves your Pokemon's Terror type will hit even harder when it's terrestrialized, you know. Sometimes you'll find a Pokemon whose Terror type is totally different. That difference can open up your strategic options. Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Man, it's because I've been drinking so much. Between the water and then these ices, it's like, man. <clears throat> gotta stay hydrated, though. If you're doing these long streams, you gotta stay hydrated. Well, I'm gonna be on my merry way then, yeah? Asa La Vista. Oh, Asa La Vista Star. <laughs> okay. Team Star is basically a group of students that like to kick up trouble. They hardly ever show up to class, and when they get together in groups, they're a real headache. Even the teachers don't know what to do with them from what I hear. All right, here's Penny. I just want to say thanks. All right, well, at least she's being nice. See you around. Maybe Penny will grow on me. Look, you're being a big hero on campus. <laughs> I don't think I've seen that girl around. Maybe she's a new transfer like you. That Eevee bag, though. Love the fluff. Anyway, seems like the trouble's died down, so we better book it up to the school. Get ready to climb the worst staircase in the world. I'm ready. All the way up. Your mission, go to school. It's tough being a kid, so tough. It is not tough being a kid. You think when you're a kid, it's tough being a kid. When you're an adult, you realize it is not. It is tough being a middle schooler or a teenager for sure. But being a kid, being eight years old, playing Pokemon all day, that's not tough. I'm sorry. All right. They have Psyduck behind the counter. <laughs> For some reason, they banned Pokemon battling in the main entrance. I wonder why. Roger, Nimona. How do you find your first school commute? It was all right. We had a blast. <laughs> Reliable as ever, Miss Nimona. Speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Star kids in town, Director. You did? Where? It was down the stairs from the front gates. They were hassling this kid with an Eevee backpack. Quite the news. Are they still found out there? Well, actually, Roger's base flexed on them and they ran off. You don't say. Of course, it's a fine thing to try to help a fellow student, Master Roger's base. But you might wish to show a bit of restraint when you find your feet here at our academy. <laughs> no restraint needed. Okay. Oh, so he's already heard about Penny as well. If you'd be so good, do report to Mr. Jacques about the Team Star business. As your homeroom teacher, he should be kept appraised of all things. Sure thing. Alright, class is starting soon. Class 1A. I'm not saying anything, man. I'm not saying anything. We're in class 1A with Todoroki. Hello, everyone. We have exciting news this morning. Who wants to hear it? 
I suppose I should have told you sooner, but we have a new little friend joining our happy homeroom as of today. It's me! Could I trouble you for a few words introducing yourself? Yo, why are the kids in the background 2 FPS? What's happening there? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. I'm Rogers Base. Did you hear that? He's super friendly. Everyone's eager to get to know you, Roger. Who wants to be the first to ask a question? All right. What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? Um, I like everything about Pokemon. Really? That's awesome. I'm totally the same. Does anyone else have a question for their new classmate? Me, I have a question. You all went to the trouble of enrolling here, so spill, Roger. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? Uh... I want to be a strong trainer. I want to complete. I want to complete the Pokedex. Honestly, I'm glad I got you set up with the Pokedex app. Then. All right. Well, thank you for telling us a bit about you, Roger. I teach biology here at the academy, and I'm also your homeroom teacher. That's your seat, second row from the front. All right, Ragamuffins, be nice and friendly to our new classmate. We will, Mr. Jacques. We love our bread, we love our butter, but most of all, we love each other. All right, get to know the Academy campus by exploring it better on your own. All right, let's go. Looking for an Amona? A math class is available to take. I don't take a math class. All right, let's go. Cafeteria, staff room. Um... Here, let's go to the staff room. Let's talk to Nimona. Here we go. Oh, there's the actual champion, right? Because Nimona's champion level, but she's not the actual champion. Very well, champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my stead. You can count on me. Pardon me. Hey, Roger. She looked awesome. Who was that? Good eye. She sure is. That lady, well, they call her La Primera. She's strong. She can pretty much do anything. She's got cool, practically coming out her ears. She's everything I want to be. Or that any Pokemon trainer would want to be, really. La Primera. Reminds me, remember in Homeroom when I asked your dream? Now, I know you said about completing the Pokedex, but hear me out. You should try to reach champion rank. I will. Well, I got a whole spiel. I don't care. Just tell me where to go for the gym. I do like this music, though. Take on eight Pokemon gyms and then win so you can collect their gym badges. When you've done all that, all that's left is a special test, the champion assessment. And once you pass that, then at long last, you'll be a champion. See, there's not just one champion anymore. Now there's champions, multiple champions, champion level. Every Pokemon trainer's dream, the coolest title anyone could ever hope to get. Not to brag or anything. I reached champion rank during our last treasure hunt, you know. And the treasure hunt is a special independent study we got here. Should happen soon. Our last one started not long after the beginning of the school year. It's great. You get to leave school and go have an adventure. And learn however you want. I want a real Lou, by the way. You could say my journey to becoming a champion was the treasure I found, maybe. I don't know yet. Anyway, I got a feeling that I'd be able to get even stronger if you and I were both working at it. Let me go ahead and save the gym locations in your map app in case you decide to go for it. All right. And we could do these in any order, right? The Pokemon gym locations have been added to your map, so obviously Artisan is the first one. 
That's the grass guy that we saw in all the trailers. Hmm? Victory Road. Give it some thought. Okay, you got it. So we can basically do whatever we want then. So now all the gyms are open to me. Fantastic. Where do I want to go? We could talk to Arval in the cafeteria. Let's go do this. Okay. What's up, Arval? We meet again. He seems nicer here than he was before. Yeah, I remember you from the lighthouse. Huh? <laughs> no need to tell me your name. Roger's base, right? Whole school's talking about you. The new kid who showed up with the president of the student council. I normally wouldn't even bother showing up for a class, but I came all the way to school today just to talk with you, our new celebrity. I mean, I do have 300,000 subscribers, not to brag, you know. <laughs> I'm kidding! You gotta help me out so I can finally make my dream a reality. Happy to help. What kind of little maniac says yes to something without even knowing what they're agreeing to? Me! Let's go. Might come as a surprise, but the fact is I'm all about that picnic life. The great outdoors, the perfectly prepared sandwiches, all of it. Not half bad at cooking either, let me tell you. Researching new recipes that'll help Pokemon feel better. Real health food, see? Okay, well I found this book the other day, excuse me, and it had a section about Herba Mystica things. Some kind of special herb that heal up Pokemon as soon as it eats them. There are five different types of Herba Mystica based on what I've read. So just taking a little lick of, uh, of them once, they've been powdered, will get your blood flowing. Provide nutrients, prevent aging, it'll even boost the immune system. These herbs seem like the real deal, and they're only found in Paldea, and rare to boot. But the book says they're guarded by Titan Pokemon, meaning it's going to be pretty tough to even grab a few sprigs of them. Titans are, well, they gotta be things like this. Give me the Donphin, please! As we descended further into Area Zero, we began to catch glimpses of mysterious Pokemon. We wondered if these huge, ferocious beasts were indeed Pokemon at all. One of our teams suffered a brutal blow from such a beast and was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat. So this Donphan literally almost killed somebody. A member of the survey team captured this photograph by chance. It has a passing resemblance to Donphan, yet differences in its sheer size and shape um, set it apart, as do its great tusks. Okay. I want to get these herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. I'll help you, don't worry, Arvin. You don't have friends with strong Pokemon? I'm your friend! Trust in me. And he didn't want to go crawling to the school council girl. I don't blame you. Nimona's kind of boring anyway. I'm, I'm, I like you more, Arvin. I'm here to help you. I don't need an answer yet. I'll just register the places. But I'm giving you an answer. I'm happy to help. Oh, I like his phone case, too. I also like our little Quaxley phone case. <laughs> Titan's layers have been added to your map app. All right. The Path of Legends. Fantastic. Let it stew a bit, and we can get more details later. In the meantime, take this. A gift for listening. Got some stardust. All right. Give the idea some serious thought, please. Again, I agreed already, but I want to be your friend. All right, here we go. What is this? My Rotom phone. This is Roger's base, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk to you. Hope you don't mind. Who are you? Cassiopeia. Never mind that. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. If the description is accurate, there's something I want to ask of you. Do you know about Team Star? Unfortunately, I do. I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of tro troublemakers formed by Academy students a while back. They cause headaches for the school and try to bring other students down to their level. That kid has a Zoroa? That's pretty good. I refuse to sit idly by and let them get away with it. I came up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. Operation Starfall. 
I'll need allies to carry out the operation. I'd like you to be one of them. I'm ready. No need to reply right this second. We can discuss the details later. I'm telling you all I want to do everything. I'm replying to you now. I'm ready. Master Rogers Base. Please do try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? Shut your mouth, Clavel. I'm a grown man. I can do what I want. Shut up. I'll be more careful, I guess. You don't want anyone else overhearing personal information, after all. Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. That's true. Especially with Twitter going the way it is. All right. On you go, young man. Here we go. Off we go. Team Star, you say? Is he working with the delinquents? This is actually a really nice school, too. Tons of books everywhere. Calling Rogers Base to the director's office, please. Uh-oh. Master Rogers Base to the director's office. Yeah, I'm getting expelled. <laughs> Roger told the director to shut his mouth. That's expulsion. I'm getting expelled, man. Look at how cool it is over here, though. Man. Books on books on books. Like, what's over here? Where do I want to go? I guess the director's office. Okay. Less than a day and you're already expelled? Hey, it is what it is. That means more time in the open world to catch other Pokemon. I don't need to go to school. Thank you for coming, Roger's Base. Have you been enjoying your time here? Yeah, it's nice. That's wonderful to hear. Now, you may be wondering why we could not have simply conversed earlier in the cafeteria. Let me assure you, there was a reason why I asked you to come here to meet me in my office. It seems a friend of mine had a rather serious matter they wanted to discuss with you. Oh? Get on a Zoom call? Ah, uh, the professor! I was wondering when we were going to see her! Hello, Rogers Base. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> My name is Professor Sada. I carry out Pokemon research within the great crater of Paldea. Research at a site known as Area Zero. There we go. That's, that's definitely for the thumbnail. Future thumbnails, at least. Professor Batty? <laughs> yeah, exactly. The professor is a graduate of our fine academy as well as a splendid researcher. Allow me to get straight to the point. Student ID number 805C393. You are the student who travels with the unusual Pokemon Coridon, is that correct? Sure am. Apparently it was your Pokemon, because Arvin gave it to us. I appreciate you were honest with confirming the facts. I like her theme. What assistance do you need from me? <laughs> Corridon was once in my care, you see? Its Pokeball was also originally mine. I assume you received it from a young man named Arvin? Yeah, I know, that's your kid. I am no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. This is what I would ask of you. Will you continue looking after Coridon on my behalf? Of course! I appreciate your agreement. Yeah, give me your number, baby. Come on, let's go. You'll be in regular contact? That's fine with me. Until then! Good 
Could this Pokemon have its origins within Area Zero? He's even got the evil glasses push going on. <laughs> Sada, don't tell me you actually did it. What did she do? I'm sure we're going to find out. All right. It seems the professor has taken quite the favor of you. All right, well, let's go. Hello, excuse me. You're still here, Roger? Getting called to the director's office? Oof. How'd you land in that much trouble already? Namona definitely is a Twitch chat member for sure. She's saying oof regularly. All she needs to say is yikes next. Yikes and oof. Or mid. If she says mid, then I know it's over. All right, we're going to my room. Let's check this out. Your dorm room. A nice space of your own, away from home. Let's see it. It's where I can study and sleep. Now, my question is, can I doll up my dorm room like you used to be able to do all the way back in Pokemon Stadium 2 where you can get the little plushies and line them all up and have your little video game systems because that'll be awesome. Also, he's got a microwave. He's got a hot plate. From today on, this is your room, Rogers Base. It's as new to me as it is to you. Never been in here before. Well, I would hope not. Check out your new bed. It looks comfy. And you must be pretty worn out from all the stuff happening on your first day. A quick rest is all you'll need to get yourself and your Pokemon healthy. All right. I'll see you tomorrow when you've rested up. And then we can battle even more. You got it. I want to get some more clothes, actually. All right, here we go. Rest on up. Ready to call it a day. I'm prepared for my new school life. I want to go to the gyms. I want to fight some titans. I'm ready. Shingeki no Pokemon. Let's go. Well, that's kind of cool. The days quickly fly by as you start your new life at Naranja Academy. And then at last, the day arrives for your adventure to begin. They said, don't worry, you need to don't you don't have to go through any math classes or anything like that. You're gonna be okay. All right, let's go. Today marks the beginning of an important new assignment. All right, let's go. It's time! <laughs> I've been waiting forever for this. Come on, we gotta go to the schoolyard. Look at this, I've got a couple things out there now. I've got my coffee cup. I've got my books. All right, let's get out of here. I'm ready, let's go. I know. Going to the schoolyard, let's go. I think the J in Naranja is supposed to have an H sound since Naran Naranja is Spanish for orange. Naran Naranja Academy? Oh. That's good to know, Naranja. All right, the theme is gonna be a treasure hunt. I'm ready. Let's do it. I ask each of you to set out and travel the world in search of your own treasure. I'm ready. Are these gonna be some of the other teachers? You've all learned much within the walls of our fine academy. Okay. Now it is time to turn your eyes upon the wider world and deepen your understanding. Explore Paldea's abundant nature. Soak in its rich culture. Discover all the Pokemon that live here. We got Tropius over there as well. Get to know the people too. Where will you travel? Who will you meet? And what will you achieve? Of course, your Pokemon partners will be there to help you. You will journey together. Learn new things together. And share each other's thoughts and feelings. And find something you might always treasure. I look forward to welcoming you all back to your independent study. All right, great. When you return to us as fine young trainers. 
Let the treasure hunt begin. Onward! Earthquake said, and that's how the great pirate era began. <laughs> the school era. <laughs> I left everything I own in one piece. There's a little Cyclazar. See, they're all basic though. <laughs> they have Cyclazars, I have Koridon, I'm good. No entering the crater, it's a violation of school rules. You got it. Speak to the front desk to take classes, by the way. You'll eventually get rewards and stuff. Let me do that. He sent me off on the treasure hunt. I'm all ready to go take some classes. I want some rewards. And then I want to go to the gym. What class do you want to take? Battle studies. Yes. All right, let's go. Oh, you get Pokemon gifted through you for, uh, to you from the classes. Really? Awesome! Hey, say hello to your battle instructor, the hot-blooded Dendra. Osu's a karate thing, by the way. Look it up. Yeah, we've watched Hunter Hunter. Age 25. Hobby, working out. My type? Well, she's fighting, obviously, right? Of course. That's all for my introduction. It's for my classes where you get to learn the nitty-gritty of Pokemon battling. We're going to start with the basics that no trainer gets left in the dust. I'm ready. All right, Pokemon have all kinds of attack moves at their disposal, and each move has certain qualities that you'll want to remember. I'm talking power, type, and category of moves. Higher power means more damage, especially if your opponent's weak to that move. A heads up, new kid, question coming your way. Two categories, special and physical, obviously. Boom! You're just as sharp as I expected, new kid. Looks like you have a handle on the basics. Attack moves are split into two. Okay. Defense and special defense. In conclusion, Pokemon that are good with physical should raise attack. Pokemon good with special moves should raise special attack. That's right. Make your strong points stronger, I say. That goes for both Pokemon and people. Oh, we're already out of time? Class is over for now. Take care, you little rascals. That was quick. No reward from that, though? <laughs> you were about to find out your Nen type, Roger? <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. I want to go to the first gym. I could always come back later. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Because we can fly right now, right? If we wanted to. I'm going to set my destination for the first gym. Let's see, where is that again? Uh, Alfornada? I remember it being down here on the map. Oh, Cas I think it's this one. Kaskarafa, I think. Set his destination, okay. Yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. <laughs> Alright, let's go. The first gym is the Bug Gym in the West. Alright, I'm excited. Treasure Hunt's a huge part of the Naranja Academy school year. The point isn't to get us all looking for some actual hidden treasure, necessarily. We're just more making our own adventures to see what experiences Paldea's got to offer us. You can try to beat Pokemon Gyms, you can help out people in need, you can hunt for real capital T treasure if you wanted, even. 
There's stuff we never learned sitting in a classroom, you know? So this is our chance to learn it. I'm ready. I want to fight her again already. I'm ready. Let's go. Oh, battling can wait. Did you know your phone's map lets you set destinations? I did know that. I've been using that. How's that for a student council president? Giving your own feds insider advantages. <laughs> Arvin? Insider advantages? You make it sound like we're cheating. All I did was suggest he goes to the gyms. He's like, no, he's going to be busy searching Titan Pokemon with me. <laughs> me and him are going to be too busy visiting the layers of Titans and nabbing their Herba Mystica. And cereal? Don't go filling his head with weird stories. All I did was invite him along. It's still up to Roger where he wants to go, right? All right. Cassiopeia here. It's about Operation Starfall. Remember what I told you before? Team Star is made up of five individual squads. That's right. I need you to East Base, all five of them, and beat the squad boss there. The grunts might try to get in your way, but I'll be helping you out from a distance. And a heads up that the bosses each specialize in a different Pokemon type. Remember the names of their crews, and you'll figure it out. Look, I'm ready, Cassiopeia. Honestly, I don't want to know... I like... I don't know if I want to go to Team Star first, if I want to do a gym first, if I want to do a Titan first. I really don't know. Starfall Street. Good luck with the bosses. I'll hook you up with nice rewards every time you beat one. <laughs> Team Star is a serious hazard? They're not Roger's base's problem. That's right, he's got more important things to do, like hanging out with me. <laughs> I, I think Arvin's my favorite so far. I like him a lot. <laughs> See? She knows you guys. <laughs> what was that all about? I'm glad you're making plenty of friends, but try not to get dragged into anything dangerous. No more weird vibes. We got a big adventure to start. I'm going to battle every Pokemon trainer I meet. All right, I'm ready. Start by heading to a gym and training up some new Pokemon. I'll send you a picture of what the gym buildings look like. Okay. I know we've been running our mouths, but it's your call what you want to do, Roger. Go where you want and do what you want to do the most. You got it. For me, that's got to be, well, dreaming of tracking down the Herba Mystica. When we get those herbs, I'll make you the absolute best sandwich you ever had in your life. Okay. He wants a sandwich? <laughs> well, you're not getting one. All right, let's go, Coridon. I'm ready. Press the start button to jump on Coridon and B to jump over obstacles. I'm ready. There we go! We're ready to start our adventure. <laughs> now it really looks like some kind of weird Cyclazar, huh? As long as you've got Coridon, you can go pretty much anywhere. Paladea is your cloister. So how it works basically, Roger, is gyms allow you to catch and train Pokemon of higher levels while working with Arvin to take on Titans. Those will give Maridon new methods of transport. Oh, okay. So the Titans give new methods of transport. The gyms allow me to level up my Pokemon. All right, so I'm going to do a gym first, obviously, then. Go for the West Gate. Okay. All right, see you around, Roger. You got it. Out the West Gate we go. Now let's do, let's see, look at the map, Y, now I had my destination set down here with the grass guy, who I think I could pretty easily beat right now, um, but I think I need the water to get over there is the only thing, so I might need to go to the bug girl instead. Let's see, 
Victory Road. Electric Gym, I'm not ready for yet. Let's see. Zoom in. There's so much stuff to do here. Man, oh man, oh man. Poison Crew. Let's see this. Atticus is of middling strength amongst the Team Star bosses. Okay. And this is another Team Star boss over here. Got Ionio. East Paldean Sea. Oh, the map was rotated weird. That's why. Okay. Here we go. Let's go here. Katie the Sugar Bug. Easy. Set his destination. Let's go. So she is out this gate. Let's get on Karina now that we can. Jump around. Look at this. All right. I'm finally starting. All right. Now I got to go out the gate, right? I can't go this way yet. Make our way through the alleyway. Egg power. All right, here we go. I'm excited to just explore the city and see what else is going on in there, too. You can also fixate the map by um, clicking down on the right stick. Good to know. All right, let's go. By the way, Roger, Karu is close to evolving. I don't want to evolve Karu yet. He's too cute. I like him as a Quaxley. All right. We got little picnics over here. My bag's uh, full to bursting with ingredients. Let me share some. Thank you! Strawberry, cheese, and jam. All right. Yeah, let's have a picnic. Why not? Have a picnic with my Pokemon team. And your Pokemon look like you're all full of energy. Come again anytime. You got it. There's so much to do over here, man. It's just cool. All right. Let's fight her. Oh, we got some Starlies. Okay. Some Mareeps. No other student. All right, Doflamingo. Let's see what you can do. I think I want to rename Doflamingo Dofi, though. Dofi's just cuter. Alright. There's an Eevee camper on that side. There's also a Pikachu one on the other side. Oh, fun. Uh, Drifloon? Yeah, let's switch. Let's switch to... Let's switch to Garchu. <laughs> okay. Garchu! Sent out Drifloon. <laughs> Game's like, bro, that's straight up a flamingo. It really does just look like a flamingo. <laughs> Alright, good work. Nuzzle, paralyze him. I also, I have to look at their stats. I don't know if they're like more physical or special. I gotta take a look. All right, are you gonna name all your Pokemon after One Piece characters? No, no, not all of them. Just Dofi and Karu, probably. And maybe some others. We'll see. <laughs> Here, let me catch a Starly. I need one for my Pokedex. Level eight Starly. Oh, I killed it accidentally. <laughs> Jeez. All right, let's go after, uh, let's get that Mareep instead. Also a young goose. I still need to catch a young goose, I think. There's stuff all over. I just like, I want to explore. There's so much to do. All right, Mareep. Very good, I'll catch one of these. Thank you, by the way, to Rico, Reaper, and Moon Dude, all for subscribing. Appreciate that. Thank you. All right. Throw a Pokeball. <laughs> B 
Beautiful. In the bag you go, Mareep. Very good. All right, the wool Pokemon. If static electricity builds in its body, its fleece doubles in volume. Touching will shock you. No nickname, I'm good. For the time being. Just filling out my Pokedex. Young Goose over here. <laughs> How you liking the game so far? I really am having a great time. It's super fun. I like being able to go wherever I want to go. Oh, that's definitely going to kill it. I shouldn't have done double kick. That's okay, though. Wild Young Goose fainted. All right, let's see. Got Starly over here. I forgot I got Karidon. I could leap now. Woo! Pick that up. More Young Gooses. More Reaps. We got the Pokemon Center over here. Here, I'll actually heal up here real quick. Whoops. Nope. Wrong thing. There we go. Heal my Pokemon up, please. Okay. It's funny, my squad is pretty much the same from about an hour ago. I like the characters we got so far. Alright. Make our way down here. And then, there's like a tower over here? Okay, interesting. <gasps> Small F! Small F! Small F! Finally! Small F! Okay, oh, I don't want to knock him out though. He's only level 7. Alright, I'm switching. Switching LeChonk out. Oh, small live! I've been wanting a small live! I like small live. Evasiveness. <laughs> okay. Tackle. Don't kill small live. Absorb. Alright. Here we go. Oh, it's still in the green. Alright. Here, I'll do another tackle. It's pretty good. Oh, no! Small F! No! I turned him into small of oil! I killed him! No, I know crew's not a- I don't want crew to evolve. No, 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 no! No! No, 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 no! 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 Stop evolving. I gotta get an Everstone quick. I don't want that thing to evolve. I wanna keep it Quaxly at least for a little while. And I gotta get another small of. Hold on. I can't believe I killed him. I turned him into small of oil. You said there's plenty of small of's. That's good. I'll get another one then. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's a TM. Hold on. Electro Ball. All right. Excuse me. Here we go. Ooh. Give me ghoul. All right, cool. I'll catch this thing. Wing attack, let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, Astonish. I want to catch one of these guys. A Gimme Ghoul. Perfect. You got me saying small of oil in Popeye's voice? <laughs> what? Here we go. You can also buy Everstones in the Deli Bird Shop. That's right. That's right. Because I can fast travel to any place I've been already, right? I can just fast travel over to the Deli Bird Shop, get the Everstone, and then I'm good to go. All right, I'm going to catch this thing with a Great Ball instead. There we go. Perfect, perfect. Gimme Ghoul. Perfect, perfect, perfect. The Coin Chest Pokemon. This Pokemon was born inside a treasure chest 1,500 years ago. It sucks the life force out of scoundrels who try to steal the treasure. Uh, you, know, you know what we're going to call this, obviously. I mean, like... <laughs> this is it. 
I mean, this is so unbelievably obvious, but this is what we have to call it. Oh, no, there's not room. The One Piece. <laughs> there we go. Let's go into the box, though, for the time being. All right. <laughs> or actually, I have a funnier idea for a name. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got a funnier idea. Boxes. Check summary. Oh, does it not let me change the name in the box? All right, hold on. Uh, I'm going to put Applewood away for the time being. And, oh, I like Garchu and Fidobi. I don't want to get rid of either of them. What level, curiously, chat, what level does Garchu evolve? What level does Fidobi evolve? I am very curious. Because one of them is going to have to go for Smoliv. When I get Smoliv, one's got to go. And I don't know which one I want to get rid of yet. Because I like them both. And I feel like I can't get rid of Fidobi. Fidobi's too cute. Alright. Summary, right? You go to summary. Change name. Change nickname. Here we go. I'm going to name it I'm Real. The One Piece is real! <laughs> and then... Let's see. I'm gonna put this guy on my team. Gimme Ghoul Coin 50, wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. You can just jump down and then Ronum catches you? It's kinda cool. Whoa, what's that? What is that? Oh, that's just a Starly. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the Pokemon Center. Palmy evolves at level 18? Oh, well then I'll, I'll hang on to Palmy for a little bit. Is Smoliv over here though? I must find Smoliv. We got Hoppip. Okay. Got Ether. Here we go. The Great Ball. You could look at the fields and you'll see Smoliv on there. Oh, well, I'm already making my way down to go to the gym anyway, so I figure I'm probably going to run into one naturally on my way over. So I'll just let it happen naturally. Here, get some of this. Cricket tot. There we go. All right, here we go. I'm gonna catch a cricket tot. Battle. Double kick will probably kill it, but if not, that'll be great. Mm -hmm. Good. 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 I'm gonna use a pokeball. Perfect. Krikatot was caught. Lovely. All right. The Cricket Pokemon. Here we go. Put him in the box for the time being. It's cute. What is this? What is that? Like a shiny or something? What is this supposed to be? Oh, oh, Terra type. Okay. You can just find these in the wild? Oh, you can't catch a Pokemon when it's terrestrialized. Oh, got it. I mean, that's fine. Copycat. Astonish. Okay. We'll double kick. Oh, I flinched. Wait, but he's terrestrialized, but he's 
clearly terrestrialized the ground type. Why is he using Astonish? Also, what is that back there? What is that thing? Is that a trainer? Here we go. Perfect. All right, catch catch the Diglet. Oh, that's actually the Rock Terra type. Oh, interesting. I thought it was the ground one. Here we go, I'll catch this thing. Perfect. Diglett was caught. All right, excellent. Garchu, place with fork, focus energy, no, I'm good. Baby doll eyes. Uh, I think I'm gonna get rid of Tail Whip. I'm never gonna use that. Okay. All right, we've got another trainer. Diglett, I'm not gonna use you. Obviously, you're an old Pokemon. Unless you're an absolute all-time favorite, something like Talonflame or oh 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 oh, careful, careful. What level is this? Nine? Uh, let me bring my Pokemon out. Wait. Let me bring out. Change position. I'm gonna bring out Karu. Here we go. Smolif. Let's get Smolif. Here we go. All right. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. Little Smolif. Just a little guy. Don't kill it. Water gun, perfect. One more water gun and I'm good. Good, good, good. And he's using growth, good. Excellent, excellent. One more. I gotta catch my silly little guy. Boom. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Come on, Smolif. Special attack, Rose, excellent. Here we go. Please join my squad. Beautiful. Smoliv was caught. Beautiful. The question is, what am I going to nickname this thing? What am I going to nickname Smoliv? The Olive Pokemon. It protects itself from enemies by emitting oil from the fruit on its head. The oil is bitter and astringent, enough to make someone flinch. It has been added to the Pokedex. Will you give Smolov a nickname? Yes. What am I going to nickname Smolov? Uh, obviously, when I see Smolov, I think Olive Garden. You can't name him Soup, Salad, and Breadsticks. It's too long. Hmm, what am I going to name Smoliv? I kind of don't want to name him. I kind of just want him to be Smoliv. I think I'm actually not going to nickname him. I like Smoliv. The name is perfect. Name him Soup Salad? <laughs> Soup Salad! Soup Salad! <laughs> uh, for the time being, I think I'm going to replace Garchu. Yes. Final answer. Very good. Look at his little anxiety-ridden face over there. Hold on. Like, let's look at the Pokedex real quick. Where's the Pokedex? Hold on. Also, don't I get Pokedex rewards or something, too? Pokedex. Here we are. Recently caught little Smoliv. Look how cute he is. The olive Pokemon. <laughs> little Smoliv. Okay. Actually, you know what? I want to catch a second one so that I can trade one to Reagan. I'm going to do a second one, too. Hold on. Small of get over here. <laughs> here we go. Oh, and it's a girl one, too. Perfect. Perfect. I'll keep the boy one. She'll have the girl one. And we'll have our little small of's. <laughs> I like it. Small of looks like he's seen some stuff. He does. That's why I love him so much. <laughs> Little Smolov. 
Is Smolov version exclusive? No, 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 no. Everyone can get a Smolov. But he's just so cute. I've loved Smolov from the moment I saw him. I just think he's a goofy looking guy. And I want him on my team. <laughs> I don't even want to evolve him. I want to keep him Smolov. I would maybe sooner evolve my Quaxley than evolve my Smolov. <laughs> so I just like saying his name. Smolov. A little Smolov. All right, he's been sent to the box. Here we go. Now let's actually go to the gym. All right, let's make our way to the gym. I can come back here later to catch some other guys, but for the time being, I want to get my first gym badge so I don't accidentally lock myself out of progress. Excuse me. All right. We're going to do this. We got a whole thing of combies. Is there a female one? Wait, 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 wait. Male. No. Let me crouch a little bit. Male. They all look like they're male combies. Yep, they're all male, so you know what I'm gonna do. Amy Adams, it's your time. Amy Adams. Let's go. Take them all out, Amy Adams. You got this. One. <laughs> okay, second one, where are you going? away <laughs> poor little combies were scared all of them off boom <laughs> getting the extra combi honey more of them come on over here go away man do what you gotta do <laughs> alright we're good we're actually we're in the town that's the bug gym so we're gonna be using her anyway A little cricket tot is this a trainer over here? Can I fight you? Oh, happy day! I bought delicious cake for the patisserie soap berry. Let's celebrate with a battle. Alright, I'm ready. Challenged by David the office worker. He seems happy to be here, doesn't he? Sending out Fan P. Oh, I want a Fan P. Okay. Obviously, I'm gonna swap Pokemon. Uh, what level is it at? Nine? Do I risk it? He's got absorbed. Small live, I want you to live. Roger's putting combi honey on a burger. Oh my god, you're making me hungry. We gotta order dinner kind of soon, honestly. It's a good reminder. I want a sandwich that I can put honey on. Oh, there's Jigglypuff over there. I want to get Jigglypuff too. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Absorb. There we go. Come on, Smolov, you got this, buddy. I have faith in you. <laughs> Tackle? That's not a problem. We got this. Come on, Smolov. You've got this. We're terrestrializing, baby! Come on! Smolov, you got this. Look at his goofy little face. With flowers growing out of his head. <laughs> I want to beat the champion with the Smolov, honestly. This Smolov, he's not leaving my team the rest of the game. I'm telling you right now, for the rest of the playthrough, I don't care what his stats are. Doesn't matter to me. Smolov is not leaving the squad. I like him. He's staying Smolov. I'm not evolving him. I know the evolve form's kind of cute, too. But you're not beating Smolov. All right. Razor Leaf taking down Tackle. Very good. David the Office Worker. Here we go. <laughs> this cake makes me so happy, I don't even mind losing. Yeah, I honestly think there's a high likelihood that I don't evolve Smolov or Quaxley. I like Quaxley's final form is the only thing. But, all right, let's catch this Jigglypuff. All right, Amy Adams, do what you gotta do. You swift. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Brought it down just enough. I'm surprised Amy Adams hasn't learned Wing Attack yet. Here we go. Pokeball, go. Go. 
What time is it by you? It's 1 a.m. here and I've got pizza? Ooh, you got some pizza. It is 5 p.m. by me, so it's almost dinner time. Jigglypuff, the balloon Pokemon. You always got to catch a Jigglypuff, of course. I love Jigglypuff. Probably won't use her, but I like her. All right. Jigglypuff. Also, there's an item over there I want to... Uh, no, it's too far out of the way. We'll go back there later. Here we go. Heal up. Had some battles. That's a quest for me to fill out later. Heal up my Pokemon. Yeah, the, exactly. The only thing that I'm going to do different... The only thing is if I find a shiny Smoliv, then I'll replace regular Smoliv. But otherwise, Smoliv is Smoliv. Got my Terra Orb charged. Fantastic. Change my photos. Alright, fantastic. I am ready to fight. Here we go. And actually... Let's see. Can I buy anything over here? What is that? Wait, what the heck is that thing? What is, what is that? Is that a new... Is that like a bug or something? What the heck is that? That is a brand new Pokemon. This town is really cool too with all the bugs everywhere. Got a battlefield over here, okay. Let me see, are there any other... Oh, look at the little Smolivs on the top of the car. <laughs> All right, let's see. Welcome. Fresh produce. Eggs, potato ch salads, and chorizo. Wait, I want to sell stuff. That's my main thing. Here, I want to get this. Here we go. Our first gym, baby. I feel like this gym is going to be a breeze, too, because we've got multiple flying types. I got Quaxley. I got Doflamingo. Oh, speaking of, hold on, wait, wait. I wanted to change Doflamingo's name. Just because I think Dofi is funnier than saying Doflamingo. Dofi. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Fidobi, Smolov, Dofi, Karu, I'm Real, and Amy Adams. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Very happy with this initial squad. Alright, here we go. Arrived at our destination. Your energy is unmatched. It makes your stream so enjoyable. I'm happy you're enjoying it. Alright, here we are. What's up, Rogers Base? Came to see the gym, huh? That can only mean one thing. Out to earn some gym badges? I sure am. Also, the accordion version of the gym theme? <laughs> I knew it. I'm so glad I asked you to do it. Before you can battle the gym leader, you gotta pass a certain challenge? I'm ready. Have these. Got some super potions. Excellent. I'm so glad you're aiming to become a champion too. The best news ever. I'm so excited I could barely stand. All right. Look, I'm ready, let's go. Amy Adams is about to evolve in this gym fight. I can't wait. Welcome to Cortando Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. You're Rogers base, right? Great. Now in order to face the gym leader, Katie, you need to pass the gym test. Okay, that means taking on the olive roll. Olive production is a big part of life in Cordondo. We've held the Olive Harvest Festival for years and generations to usher in bumper crops. To pass our gym test, you'll need to roll an olive-shaped ball all the way to the goal. Your efforts will ensure that we get a great olive harvest next year, too. The staffer over at the olive rolling field will explain the rules. I really, I genuinely want something with olive oil for dinner tonight. Specifically, a sandwich with olive oil. Ohio from Japan. Ohio! Good morning! Happy Pokemon Day! We're about to take the olive test. Alright, let's see. All out defense. I'm ready. Look, I'm ready, man. 
No, it's the olive roll, right? All right. Be careful. Okay. Here we go. Okay, make our way up here. Do the olive harvest. Alright. Actually, you know what? Okay, let me go back. I didn't realize it's literally in the gym. Are all your Pokemon playthroughs gonna be members only like Legends was? No. Uh-uh. Nope. Nope, you guys can participate, have fun in chat, enjoy the streams. Everybody's playing Scarlet and Violet, so I feel like... Wait, why can't I get in the... Yeah, maybe tell me again. Because aren't we doing the, the little olive harvest thing? Yeah. Oh, the olive rolling field north of town. Oh, I missed that little detail. Okay, my bad. I was talking to chat. Where do you find the coin, Mon? You find it in the tower right after you leave if you're going towards the gym challenges from the main city. All right. Olive field to the north. Here we go. Ah, here we are, here we are. Boom. South Province Area 2. So we just have to put this in the goal, right? Seems easy enough. Here we go. <laughs> there we go. It's all lined up. There we are. Woo! We did it! Now what? <laughs> Do I just have to keep rolling into the goal? Where are the trainers? There's nobody here! <laughs> There's nobody here! He told me! Go to the olive field of the north but there's nobody there. Here, I want to go over here. There's a Terra Stall Pokemon. What is this? Or a Terra Den. Terra Raid Battles. Okay. Offline mode. All right. Snom. Ooh, that's interesting. I might have to do that later. Also, wait a minute, wait a minute. There are tons of little guys over here. Take them all out. Six HP, one after the other. We're getting the hop heap leafs. All right. Oh, you got to speak to the lady outside the field. Okay. I'll go that way. Here we go. Lady outside the field. Let me see. Oh, here we go. Oh, I literally just started rolling them in the goal. All right, I'm ready. Welcome to the olive rolling field. It's all about stamina. Easy. Get it over various obstacles. I'm all filled in. I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Put in a wish for a good olive harvest and roll, roll, roll away. Okay. That was just practice then me. Hitting the olive. We're good. I'm waiting. <laughs> Take on the olive roll challenge. I'm assuming I can't use Coridon for this too. <laughs> Look at all the little smallives cheering me on. All right, here we go. Now we're going this way. <laughs> Look, 
like just look how cute they are. Look at that. <laughs> With their little glowing eyes. Okay. Get another one over here. I'm assuming I can't knock it over the gate. Here we go. There's the goal. So we're going this way, I'm assuming. Can't I just go right past this guy? He's got a line of olives. The goal is just past here, I see. They're blocking my way, though. Let's see. Yeah, I guess I have to go the other way then. Okay. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, push it over that. Okay. There we go, there we go, there we go. go get over here all right we're good I'm ready for the harvest we did it gym test you passed fantastic and now they're gonna have a bountiful harvest of olives the little small olives are happy I think it's weird though because isn't she a bug gym this seems like that would be the test for the grass gym it's also weird that they showed us the grass gym leader, even though he's not the first gym leader. With that performance, I'm sure we can look forward to a great olive harvest next year. Happy to declare your gym test officially cleared. Congrats. Alright. Let's go. Off to the gym we go. Here we are. Ooh, Heracross over here. Cool. I've always liked Heracross. Okay. Yeah, they showed Ionio, too. Oh, and the Ice Guy. I forgot about the Ice Guy. Yeah, Grusha, right? Alright, welcome back, Roger. I hear you were on a roll out there. But um, shh. Big congrats from me for successfully clearing the gym test. All right, you've now earned the right to challenge the gym leader. I'm ready. Katie the sugar bug. All right, allow me to show you the battle court. I'm assuming it's outside. It's like the little elevated area that we saw earlier. Let's see. Do 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 do. Eat up, my cute little Vivalon. Ooh! It's got a little bit of that sword and shield chanting in it. Vivalon! What a lovely trainer you are. Thank you very much for your skillful olive rolling. That was quite impressive. She looks like she works at Olive Garden, bro. Did I forget to introduce myself? Forgive me. Bring me some soup, salad, and breadsticks, lady. On the double. Oh, she I'm the owner of the patisserie. So there you go. She can make breadsticks. <laughs> I'm not in my shop. I'm on duty as the leader of the Cortando Gym right now. <laughs> Forgive me. My name's Katie, and I am the gym leader. My main line of work is crafting sweets as a pastry chef. Little sweets that bring happiness with just one bite. Bug type Pokemon hiding in foliage. Both are small yet powerful. So don't let your guard down unless you want me to find yourself knocked on your feet. All right, I'm ready. Ooh! It's Jazzy? Mmm! Sent out Nimble! Oh, there's a new Pokemon! Okay! It's a bug type, obviously. Don't take my bug types lightly. You will be in for a world of pain if you do. Okay. Level 14. Uh, it's, we're probably going to still destroy this thing. Here we go. 
double kick. Oh, okay. Bug fighting? That's kind of a cool typing. Last time we had that was Heracross, right? Mmm. 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 Good work, Amy Adams. Quaxley's leveling up too. Karu wants to learn double hit. Yeah, I'll learn double hit. Let's get rid of... Oh, actually... Yeah, let's get rid of Swift. Alright. Katie is about to send out a Tarantula. Will you switch? Yeah, I'll switch in Karu. Come on, Karu. Karu! I really like the music, actually. Tarantula is going down. A single super effective wing attack. We're good to go. Beautiful. One more down. Oh, I forgot we've got Dofi as well. Switch to Teddy Ursa. Bro, of course. She's going to have a bug type Teddy Ursa. That's going to be weird. Switch in Dofi. Get all my birds in here. I got Amy Adams. I got Karu. I got Dofi. You're quite good, aren't you? How should I roll things out from here? Here we go. Teddy Ursa. Battle, we're gonna double kick. Now, my little Pokemon, time to break free from your cocoon and come into your own. What the heck is Teddy Ursa gonna do with a bug type Terrastall, though? Like, what bug move does he learn? He looks real cute with a little fairy thing on his head. Like, that's cute, but. What is he going to do? Oh, here comes the chanting again. It just seems like such a random Pokemon to have in there. If you're a bug type gym leader, Teddy or so. Here we go. Oh, wing attack. Wow! That's right, because you gained the type, so you're weak. Dang, poor Teddy Ursa. Don't Flamingo destroyed that poor little bear. He said, Kuma who? All my sweet little Pokemon dropped like flies. I'm sorry, Katie. Man, oh man. Okay, Amy Adams can evolve. This is good. We're on our way to Talent Flame. This is good. Beautiful. Amy Adams has evolved into Fletchinder. Excellent. The Ember Pokemon. Scatters embers in tall grass. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. One step away from Talonflame. Yes, I want to learn Flame Charge, definitely. Let's do... Flail, Swift, Growl. Let's get rid of Growl. Beautiful. Karu, I don't want you to evolve. No, thank you. No, 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 no. All right. Your strength rose during our battle like a nice bread in the oven. I feel that I may need to work on my own strength as well. So congrats, you passed. As proof of your victory against me, the gym leader, allow me to present you with your first gym badge. Four and a half hours in, we're at our first gym badge. Lovely. And now I'll be able to raise my Pokemon's levels. Oh, cute! I like this! I got a little cupcake for my troubles. I like my little team so far. With one in your possession, Pokemon up to 25 will be easier to catch and will listen to your commands. I see you have quite the appetite as well, so how about a TM as frosting on the cake? Pounce. Ooh, what does that do? Oh, this is probably why 
Teddy Ursa was Terra Stall. It's a bug move that Teddy Ursa can learn, and that's probably really good on Ursa Luna. The user attacks by pouncing on the target. Okay, interesting. Off you go then, until we meet again. Interesting. I want to see what else can learn that. That's cool. Um. Oh, Nimona's probably calling us. Had to tell you, my Pokemon are learning some pretty cool new moves. Be ready. How to go at the gym, by the way. I passed! <laughs> I mean, it was obvious you were going to pass, but congrats. I'm so glad I encouraged you to take on the gyms. Nice job, pass me. I'm training hard too, by the way. Day and night, going all over the place to boot. Thank goodness we have the map app. It helps a ton with figuring out where to go next, especially in a huge place like Paldea. After all, the path leading stronger usually has some strange stops and detours. Speaking of going strange places, I wonder what Arvid's up to. Anyway, catch you later. I hope um, you know that I'm going to want to battle if we run into each other, of course. All right, let's see something. Let me see. I want to really quickly go out of here. I want to see the TM bag. Pounce. 50 power. Oh, they use Dunsparce as the example image? 50 power, 100% accuracy. That could be decent, actually. Electro Ball, Thunder Wave, Rest, Acid Spray. I mean, the only one that could learn it right now is Doflamingo, so I feel like I'll give it to Doflamingo. Let's get rid of... I never use Copycat. Detect is useful and Wing Attack is useful. So let's go with that. Pounce. All right. All right, very good. And then I actually think what I want to do next, let's go to the map. Go back to Mezagoza. You go, Mezagoza West, fly here. Yep. And I want to go to the Delabird place. I also want to sell my items. Where do I sell my items? Because I have Stardust and things like that, but I, I don't know where to go use it. Is it here, maybe? At the mart here? Oh, I'd like to sell. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, okay. So you just do everything at these Pokemon Centers then. All right. I don't need... I don't know, this could all be useful eventually. I don't want to get rid of any of these. Stardust, I'm gonna sell four of these. Look at this, you have ingredients, Mankey fur? Uh, no, I'm good now. I guess I'll heal my team. Here we go. The good thing about forgetting TM moves is that they can be remembered if you ever want to have Karu use Swift again. Really? That's awesome! TM moves can still be remembered and can be remembered at any point, like Arceus then. God, that's so good, man. They streamlined so many things in this one. So, like, if I go to summary real quick, just to check, and I go to moves, and I go to remember a move, because, hold on, remember a move, right? Held item. Change moves, remember a move. Astonish and tackle, okay. Ember, quick attack. I kind of want to learn Ember, actually. Just to have another option. Because I'm never going to use Flail. And then, let's see. Remember moves. Oh, Aqua Jet! Yes! Aqua Jet. High special attack, low special defense. Aqua Jet's useful, though. Work up. No, let's do Aqua Jet. I like that. 
Remember moves. Peck and copycat. Cool. Remember moves. Okay. Fido. Let's do bite. And let's replace tackle with bite. Okay. I think that's fine for now, actually. I don't know if I want to use Gimme Ghoul just yet, though. I kind of feel like I want to have somebody else. Nah, 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 nah. I like Gimme Ghoul. I like Gimme Ghoul. I'm going to keep him. All right, we're going to Deli Bird Presence. Let's see. How big are your Pokemon? Okay. Yeah, sure. Test my uh, Amy Adams. A perfectly average type specimen. Amazing. <laughs> All right, Deli Bird presence from here. What is this? This is like a food place. Let's see, like a little seafood fresco. This is so interesting that you basically like eat buffs. EXP power fighting, counter power, interesting. Yeah, and each place has its own thing. All right, Deli Bird presence. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Because I know they had Neverstone earlier. There's also a guy on the stairs that is free Rotom phone cases. Oh, I'll go check that out. Here we go. This way. Oh, I see what happened. I got shifted around. Man, this town really is huge. Okay. There it is. There it is. I see it. Oh, nope. That's food, too. Where is Deli Bird Presence? Here, go up these stairs again. Because I remember it being to the left. Uh, also, try using Poke Portal for mystery gifts. I'll definitely do that to get my Pikachu. You guys said there's a special flying Pikachu in the game right now. Deli Bird Presence. Oh, this is accessories? Ooh, good, good, good. I could get some new clothes. The Spec Shack. Oh, good! These glasses aren't even expensive. Half rim glasses. Do they have black and gold? Those are kind of cool. Because mine are like brown and black. Here, I'll buy those. There we go. All done for now. Yeah, there's so many shops, man. All right. What is this one? Hats? Oh, hats and caps. Okay. Cool. Sporty cap. Well, they have like different type. What? Gatsby cap? Oh, no, thank you. A beanie? Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's see. I kind of think I'll like the basic black one. Yeah, that's cool. Pay with LP. Wear it right away. Cool. All done for now. And then, let's see. Nice thick socks. <laughs> and shoes. Yeah, I don't need to change my shoes yet either. Coffee, okay. I'm assuming this is, okay, rough and tough. New outfits? Oh, these are gloves. Fingerless mittens. Olive gloves. OK. 
Okay. We also have different hats. Oh, pom pom hats. Oh, that's kind of cute. I kind of like that, actually. Not with the outfit I have on right now, but... Let's go back. Dude, there is so much stuff here. Pills? Chancy supply. Oh, this is probably like... Carbos and stuff. Oh, no, not yet. Not yet. These are ailments. I'm good. I just got a sick new what? Sick new shiny? Check my Twitter. What did you get, Seth? Oh! How cute! Did you see what Pokemon just tweeted out, bro? Pokemon Company! Wait, 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 wait. What? Pokemon Company just tweeted out my stream and said, Congrats on catching Small Live. Tune in to see what Roger catches next. What? Let's go! That's so cute! Thank you! I'll, here, I'll show you guys. Wait, 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 wait. Look at this. I can't believe that. Let me, hold on. Look. Small live. Oh, let me, let me move this over, hold on. Oh, it's this one, it's the other monitor, other monitor, sorry, it's this one. Look. Pokemon Company tweeted out the video and said, congrats on catching Small of tune, tune in to see what Roger catches next. <laughs> they knew I'm a Small of fanboy. I'm officially the Small of fanboy. Like forever and always now. This is me. That is so cool. I can't believe this. <laughs> small of in Poke Park 3, please. Dude, I'm the Small of fan. <laughs> Small of Ambassador Rogers base. <laughs> now you know for the next thumbnail, I gotta put Small of in there. Wow! Thank you, Pokemon Company. That is cute. I'm honored. I'm honored that I'm the Small of fan. <laughs> I cannot believe that. Small and Rogers base for the win since Reagan. Wow! I love that! Small Roger and Small of and Ash and Pikachu! It's gonna be on your gravestone one day, Small of Enjoyer. Dude, I love it. I love it. Small of really can't leave now. I have to get multiple Everstones. Alright. Where where is this this Delabird present place? Where is this? Because I can't ride on Koridon. Oh no, now I can. What is this over here? This food? Alright, we're going down here. Six man small of teen? Oh, absolutely not. No, one small of is enough for me. I'll eventually have to get a shiny too, but one small of is plenty. Alright. Deli Bird presents. Let's see. Battle items, right? Everstone. Oh no, no, no. Okay, wait. General goods, maybe? Everstone, here we go. I want two of these. I'm gonna pay with LP. Beautiful. Also, wait a minute. Power bracers, power lens, power bands, they already have all of this stuff. Power weight, soothe bell. Allows his HP stat to grow. Allows the speed stat to grow. I kind of want to give this... Can I buy this right now? I'll pay with cash. I'm gonna buy this. We're gonna go back. We're gonna go to my party. And I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna go to bag. I'm gonna do... Everstone. Give... To Quaxley, Everstone, give to Smoliv, 
I'm going to give it the power anklet. Whoops. Wait, wait, bag. I'm going to give the power anklet to Dofi. And the mystic water I'll just hold on to until I get to a point in which I either feel comfortable evolving Quaxley or if I just like want to play competitively and have Quaxley on there. I don't know. That's one thing I wish they kept from Pokemon Legends Arceus, is I wish they kept the thing where you could choose to evolve your Pokemon, where you didn't need the Everstones. Alright. I think that's good for the time being. Let me go to my Pokemon, because I kind of want to go to the Titan, too. <laughs> I'm real. <laughs> that's so funny. Alright, well now Smolov's the head of the party, too, here. Small of the actually no, you know what no, Karu still gotta be there. Small of Karu. How do I switch Pokemon slots? Change position, here we go. There we go. Amy Adams, of course. Fidobi. Fidobi's gotta level up too. I don't know if we just haven't had good moves for him yet or what, but... Alright, now we are going out the other gate to do the Titan fight, right? Let's go to my map. Lock position. Actually, we could probably fight this guy, too. He's a grass gym leader? We could probably destroy him right now. You know what? Let's do it! We don't have to... It's an open world game. I could do whatever I want in any order. I'm going here. Forget the Titan. Let's get two gym badges. Let's go, baby. I'm having a good time. Here we go. All right. Let's get on over here. Go through the other entryway. We can get the other Titan later. There we are. Roger, go to school at least. Absolutely not. I'm not going to school. What do I need to go to school for? By the way, Roger, Titan 1 unlocks sprinting on Koridon, just like Weird Deer. It makes life easy. Oh, well, then maybe I will do the Titan. Then let's do, hold on, let's do the second gym and we'll do the Titan. And that'll be good for like a first stream. Let's do that. Two gyms and a Titan. We got some picnics over here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? Little one up mushroom, buddy? Oh, this is the rock guy. What's his name? Nackley. Okay. Let's see if it lives in Aqua Jet. I'll catch it. Nackley uses rock throw. Alright. Bag Pokeball. Let's go! Alright. <laughs> Alright. Dang, my stream was tweeted out by Pokemon and YouTube today. That is wild. That is genuinely unbelievable. Man, oh man, oh man. All right, Nackley, what does this thing do? Born in a layer of rock salt deep under the earth, the species was particularly treasured in the old days as they would share precious salt. I'm not gonna give it a nickname yet. I'm interested in trying that out. You named mine Salt? You just named it Salt? You know what I would... <laughs> I got a name for it. I would name it Hyzant. <laughs> Actually, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I'm going to my Pokedex. Wait. Hold on. Because Hyzant and Triangle Strategy, the whole thing was that they were uh, monopolizing the salt. Or you could call it Sorcely, too. Oh, man. There's good, there's good ideas for names here. Hold on. Let me go to my boxes. Let's go here. Check summary. Nackley, I kind of want to use him a little bit. Here, I actually, I'm going to switch out I'm real temporarily. No, I don't want to, because like... Ah... Uh, there's too many good Pokemon I want to try. I just can't really use him right now. Let's do this, let's do this, let's do this. Okay, let's do this. Then let's go... Nackley... 
Summary, change nickname. I'm naming it Heizen. It's just a cool name. This game really is addicting, man. They did such a good job. I also like this. I got water, grass, normal, fire, flying, fighting, fairy, and rock. That's pretty good. I've got a lot of types covered. Not bad. All right. Meanwhile, let's have a Pokemon battle. All right. There's a Makuhita over there, too. Martina the student. Okay. Aracuda? Oh, Aracuda's back. Okay, cool. Karu, I'm switching you out. Temporarily, I'm switching in Smoliv. Return. Go, Smoliv. Beautiful. Alright, little Smoliv. I'm gonna terras. No, I'm not gonna terrasalize you. I don't need to do that. Razor Leaf, let's go. Aqua Jet, small lives living, dude. Look at this. He's eating it up. Beautiful. Yo, he's powerful. Wait a minute. We barely even used him, and he's actually strong. He's a strong small lives. I was like, I was going to keep him on my team even if he wasn't good, but he's actually kind of good. I like this. That was legit hilarious. <laughs> okay. Oh, I kind of want to... Wait, because th these guys evolve into Corviknight, right? I like Corviknight. Let me catch one of these. Now I need fan art of Giga Chad Smolov. I highly encourage fan art. I will say this right now. Four and a half hours in the stream. If you want to do fan art of my Pokemon, by all means do it. I will retweet it. I will like it. By all means, do fan art. I love fan art. Please do it. I encourage it. All right, here we go. Rook. Oh, I killed it. Well, that's okay. That's okay. We'll change some things. I'll find another one. There's another one right over there. Here we go. Boom. And I do really like Corviknight, so. All right, Rookity again. Here, just use a wing attack. Don't kill it. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Use Leer. Now I gotta have a small of emote by the next stream too. I should probably do that tonight. I'll make a small of emote tonight. Here we go. Rookity was caught, beautiful. All right, small of 13. He just learned a new move too, wants to learn helping hand. Ah, uh, no, I'm good. But did he remember something else is the question. Here, let's go back. Let me see. Rook a D. Let's go to Smoliv. Change summary. I just want to see if he could learn any other moves based on... Oh, hold on. This one, sorry. Moves, remember moves. Oh yeah, okay, it's just that. We're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, we got Shinx over there, too. Got a lot of guys I want to capture. What's that? There's like a cave down there? Oh, baby Shinx. He's just a little baby. <laughs> Alright, water gun. Just don't kill it. Yeah, perfect, perfect, perfect. Karu's a beast, man. He's taking on electric types and everything. This is great. Shinx was caught. Lovely. All right. Not going to give Shinx a nickname yet. I'm going to catch the Makuhita that's over there, too. All right. Here we go. All right, wing attack. That's okay. It's fine. Ugh. 
Beautiful. High Zant leveled up. All right, we're going to grab this. Uh, actually, I do want to catch this guy. Come here. Where are you at right now? I am one gym badge in with a very random team of Pokemon, but I kind of like it so far. I'm digging them. <laughs> All right, crew, here you go. Catch this Makuhita. Arm thrust, I'm living, don't worry about it. Look at this, that did nothing. Doing two HP each. We're good. Four times, all right, let's do Pokeball. Uh-oh. Well, I don't want to use my last one because if I see something cool on the way there, here, I'll just kill the Makahita. There you go, see you later, buddy. It's also cool that I'm on Koridon in the background while I'm fighting him. <laughs> it's kind of neat. All right, Makuhina fainted. Very good. Oh, and I love the fact that it doesn't do the evolution screen for Quaxley anymore. That's great. All right. Now we are going to the second gym, which I think is over this way. Oh, there's something over here. Wait a minute. EXP candy. Follow the path uphill. Oh, I guess I have to go to the other Titan then. If I can't go up, unless I can go around. Let's see. Maybe I, oh, I'm able to go around, never mind. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we got a battle. Alicia the Musician, okay. Send down Iggly Buff. All right, Karoo's got this, no problem. I'm gonna do Wing Attack. Excuse me. And then we'll finish it off with a Water Gun. Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, perfect. Yeah, it's like I want to use everybody. There's just such a good Pokemon variety in this one. But it's tough. It's like obviously I'm partial to the newer ones than the older ones. What's over here? What's this guy? Oh, another Rookity. I'll just fight it. Here we go. Aqua Jet. Boom. Wow, geez, that did a lot. I've been swiping out like 15 different Pokemon. I'm having that same problem too, I swap every area, see there you go. The thing is, I like too many that like I want on my team for sure, like Quaxley and Smoliv. And Talonflame, because there's no Lickitung in this game, Talonflame is like the next best thing, because I've always had Lickitungs or Talonflames in my team since the early, early days of my YouTube channel, so it's like, with no Lickitung, I gotta go Talonflame, which then rounds it out for my like Fire-type Pokémon. But, then I also want to use the Flamingo, who's a flying type, who's also a fighting type. I don't know. I also don't mind that my team is a bunch of birds. And I haven't even really had the chance to use Fido yet. Like, does anybody know what level Fido evolves at? By all means, tell me. I, I am not somebody who's bothered by those kind of spoilers. So if you know... When I gather, the Stony Cliff Titan lurks somewhere in this rocky area. If I had to look around, I couldn't find any trace of it. Maybe it's high up on a cliff? Maybe give your map app a look if you're feeling stumped. Okay. I will do that after the second gym. But I really, really, really want to fight the gym. Battle me, I am mighty. Okay. See this? Fido evolves at level 28. Oh, 26. Oh, great. 26 is even better. Let's do Aqua Jet. 
Boom. <laughs> Gonna stockpile up. I love you just see the little one-up mushroom crawling around in the background too. <laughs> so cute. Alright, let's terrestrialize. I haven't seen Quaxley do it yet, so. Karoo's first terrestrialization of the playthrough. Let's see what this is like. <laughs> There's the little goofball. <laughs> Flipping his hair. <laughs> Against the mighty Jigglypuff. I'm also right next to the Pokemon Center, too, which is like. <laughs> oh, because he stockpiled. Hold on a minute. Defense fell. Very good. Special defense fell. Stockpile wore off. Alright, let's do Aqua Jet again. Boom! And I love all the weird little sparkles that come off of it. Q Charm didn't matter. You're out of there. Severino is about to use Skiddo. Switch Pokemon, sure. I will switch to Amy Adams. Alright, Skiddo. And I'm gonna do Ember. There we go, lovely. That'd be awesome if we get a Talon Flame by the end of the gym. Wouldn't that be cool? Thank you, by the way, to Benjamin Yang for upgrading membership to the Mammoth Boys. Appreciate it. Nakama! Thank you very much. All right, very good. Here we go, leftovers. Battle to use Flame Charge. Get him out of there. All right. Beautiful. Rock Polish. Don't want to get rid of... Uh... Yeah, get rid of Harden. That's fine. Okay. Severino, the office worker, has been defeated. Fantastic. Love to see it. I'm gonna go heal up real quick too, so if I want to tear stall, I can. There we are. Man, I really, I cannot get over all of these tweets and all these new followers. Thank you again. I thought everyone said Twitter was going to die, and now all of a sudden I've got all these new followers. <laughs> Appreciate it. All right. Oh, is that Sapini, Young Goose? I have most of these guys. Okay. We are going to the Grass Gym. Oh, there's another little Gimme Ghoul area. Rookady. Here, I'll fight this guy too. Why not? Suddenly from the bushes. Boo! Bet you never saw that coming. <laughs> He's right, I didn't. Challenged by Benjamin the Student. Okay, let's battle Sun Current Wing Attack. <laughs> I've been watching Chainsaw Man. I watched the first three episodes on my biggest L stream a little while ago, um, but I haven't watched any since then. No, I'm not going to switch. I'm good. If he has a Bonsley, he's done. Okay. Battle. Water gun. Boom! Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, it's sturdy. I wish there was a checklist of how many trainers are in the area so you don't miss any. Well, what I'll probably end up doing is just like... Oh, oh, oh! There's a Titan! There's a Titan! There's a Titan! There's a Titan! That's the cloth or whatever it's called! That's the Titan thing! Wait, 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 wait! Hold that thought! 
I just see it walking around in the background. Wait, 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 wait. This is it, right? Oh no, this is just a regular version of it. This isn't the Titan version. Okay, cloth. I still want to catch it. I think it's so weird too that it's a rock type. Anger shell. I feel like this thing could be really, really good. All right, speed rose. Defense fell. Special defense fell. Yo, okay. I'm gonna throw a great ball and see if I catch it. Boom! Great. Cloth was caught, perfect. Look at this, everybody's leveling up real nicely. The ambush Pokemon. It hangs upside down from cliffs waiting for prey. But Cloth can't remain in this position for long because the blood rushes to its head. Want to give him a nickname? No, I'm good. I kind of like him. I want to eat Cloth. Alright. Now, are we going up or are we going to the gym? Because I think he said... The Titan's going to be up here. Oh, I see the windmill. I see the windmill. All right, we're going direction of the gym. Here we go. Got a hole. Look at this. Wait. Don't oh, let me do this. Shinx. Uh, you know what? Let's... Mm, I don't have a ground type. Can I make Hyzanth the lead and then send him out? Let's see. There we go! Take out the Shinx, very good. Very good, Hyzanth! I have to recall him before he attacks Makuhita though. Makuhita will definitely kill him. Go for the other Shinx. Look at him go! Or let's see. Oh no, see he's taking some damage. There we go. That's okay, you did your best. Oh, a Spoink! Here we go. You should name your cloth Red Lobster. <laughs> I'd call him CBB, Cheddar Bay Biscuits. <laughs> All right, let's do Rock Throw. Using Growl, that should be A-OK. -okay. Here we go. Do Mud Shot. Confusion, are you living? Ooh, poor Hyzant. That's okay. Switch in a different Pokemon. Choose next Pokemon. Fidobi. I barely used Fidobi. All right. Here we go. Bite. That'll definitely take it out. Boom. Good work. Ooh, Skiddo. Oh, see, but I don't have any Pokeballs left. Um... Oh, see, I, oh, man. I want to explore more and get more Pokeballs. Oh, small if you're not ready for this guy yet. Hold on. Switch and Dofi. Are you not evolving Quaxly? I'm, I'm not sure at this point. I haven't decided fully. I like Quaxly's final form. I've seen the final form. I think it looks cool. But I haven't decided because I like Quaxley a lot. Alright, should we replace with low kick? Oh, sure. Let's see. Double kick, pounce. Yeah, let's get rid of double kick. There we go. Beautiful. Good work, Dophie. Also, while we are here, I do want to go up there because I know there's going to be a grab a ghoul over there. Here we go. Actually, you know, no, I'll come back there. I'll come back there because I know it's here. Here, let's get this. Oh, there's the Titan. There it is. Well, we're here now. We're here now, so we might as well do this. Bag. Revive. Okay. Do I fight the Titan with Smoliv? 
Should I do it? Smolov's only level 15. But I'm kind of thinking, let's do it. Uh, let, let's fight the Titan with Smolov. <laughs> okay, Vice Grip. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck was that? All right, he's got high defense. Let's do Absorb. Rock Smash. Ooh, that's not good. That's not good. All right. Heal up again. Very good. Cloth had its energy drained. Fantastic. That anger shell is kind of scary, though, is the only thing. Smollett, hang in there, buddy. Hang in there, Smollett. There we go. Okay. Beautiful. Okay, small of a 16 wants to learn flail. Should a move be forgotten or replaced with flail? Uh, ask Smolov for advice. Smolov wants to forget Sweet Scent and learn flail. Great! Fantastic! That's what I was going to do anyway, Smolov. <laughs> How cute is that? You ask your Pokemon. And they're like, I think I'd rather forget this move. How cute. All right. I'm auto-healing. All right, we're ready to go. I'm ready. Here is the Titan. Let's fight. Come here. Oh, I think I have to go see Arvin first. Uh... Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, okay. All right, the first Titan battle, I'm ready. I'm excited. Cloth the Stony Cliff Titan. All right, battle. Growth. Vice Grip, that's kind of a scary move. Growth. Here we go. Attack Rose, special attack Rose. Let's battle. Terrestrialize and absorb. Let's do it. Small if I believe in you. If you lose here, I won't hold it against you. But if you hang in there after this, I will be very, very proud of you, Smolov. Here we go. <laughs> hang in there, hang in there, hang in there, hang in there. Absorb. Yo! Smolov! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, baby! Okay! That cloth said, I don't want to deal with that little baby olive. I'm out of there. He said, I'm done. <laughs> Not today. I can't, <laughs> I can't believe we scared him off like that. Small is ready for revenge. Float back down. Come on, let's fight this cloth again. I'm ready. He's breaking down walls. He doesn't want to fight me anymore. He's running into the mountain. He didn't want any smoke. Titan, oh, this isn't good. Titan cloth began eating something. These are the herbs. You found it. That thing's the Stony Cliff Titan. No cloth has any business being that big. Is it going to be even stronger now after eating those herbs? Probably. Let's watch ourselves, Roger's base. Oh, oh, it's a double battle? Okay. <laughs> Giant cloth versus one small of. <laughs> All right, look, I'm absorbing again. Here we go. Well, this is looking rough, Shelder. Let's serve up a helping of defeat on the half shell. I love that he's a cook and he's got shelters and cloisters. That's cool. Block, I'm not escaping. Why are you? 
Why are you worried I'm gonna run? I'm not running. Small of is holding his own. Look at this. He's fine. Well, that wasn't great, but still. All right, 41. I'm good. Look, I'm holding my own. Growth. Again. Honestly, I don't even need to do this. Terrestrialize. Absorb. Let's go. I don't need to do anything. <laughs> Come on, small up. <laughs> Get him, he's rock smashing shelter, that doesn't matter. Small lift, show him what you could do, buddy. Take him out. A little bit of help from our friend Shelter, he'll water gun. This is gonna be an Oko. Goodbye. See you later. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, it wasn't an Oko, but it still did some damage. Yo, small of when he gets Giga Drain is gonna be unstoppable. Attack Rose, doesn't matter. You think we're afraid of you? We're not afraid of you, Cloth. The Stony Cliff Titan. Not happening. I'm breaking you up, cracking off that shell, eating the crab meat out, pouring some butter over you. We're finishing it up. We're absorbing. Come on, Smoliv. Rock smash. Doesn't matter. Smoliv's living. It's super effective. It's not super effective. He's part normal, but he's still living. What am I saying, dude? Smoliv is the GOAT. Do not underestimate this man. He is the best Pokemon on our squad right now. He just destroyed a Titan. That is what I'm talking about. Good work, Smoliv. Get me some Cheddar Bay biscuits, because we are eating, boys. We defeated the Titan Claw. <laughs> me and my little Smoliv. Fantastic. <laughs> Our team's looking nice. Oh, Fidobi wants to learn Play Rough. Yeah, heck yeah. Sure, what are we getting rid of baby doll eyes? There you go. All right. Here we go. All right, look at my little buddy coming through like a champ. But these Titan Pokemon are, yeesh, I don't know. Uh, I don't like having something so tough out of me. All right, what's this? What's that little thing that's on the back of his backpack? Is that meant to be one of the little uh, mushroom guys? I bet somewhere in here there's more of that Herba Mystica the Titan was eating. So quick, let's have a look around before it comes back. Sounds good. Okay. Hmm? No way. There it is. Yes way indeed. This is one of the Herba Mystica. It's exactly how it looked in the book. You and Arvin found the sweet Herba Mystica. We actually found one and it's all thanks to you, Rogers Base. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? It says here that the sweet Herba Mystica is good for gut health and it helps aid digestion. Since it's great for stomach aches too, or when you want to stimulate the old appetite. <laughs> now, if I can just get him to eat some. <laughs> All right, now it's my turn to show off what I can do. You're about to get a taste of my cooking. I'm ready. Here you go. An Arvin original sandwich packed full of herbs. And I'll even give you a badge, you know, as a thank you for taking on the Titan Pokemon. Call it a Titan badge. Made it myself using a replica of the gym badges, see? I love the fact that you have badges for doing all that. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I love this. This game really is great. Like, for as much as I was seeing people complain about it and the frame rate and, like, the performance things, it's definitely a little buggy. Like, no doubt about it, but it is super duper fun. Like, it is really, really good. The amount, the variety of the Pokemon, the amount of stuff that you can do, it's great. 
So I'll, I'll put up with a little bit of jank here and there, like a buggy camera or a weird buggy thing popping in and out, if the game itself is good. I would much rather have a good solid game with a little bit of jank on the side than have like a mid game with good stuff kind of around it. I'm a fan. I also am very much looking forward to playing competitively with the Terra Stall thing now. Because I think it is honestly like a good little extra addition. It's not too much of a gimmick. Do you want to give your sandwich to Karida? <laughs> yeah, I guess. Here you go. Have mine instead. <laughs> I went through all the trouble of making that for you and you just gave it away? <laughs> I hope you realize that that's all there was, so now there's none left for you. Totally fine. Come on, now you're making me feel like the selfish jerk here. Here, you can have half of mine, but you better savor every last bite. <laughs> you already ate the whole thing? <laughs> Koridon's able to dash now. Fantastic. We're going to be schmoovin'. I can't believe it. The power of these herbs really is worth guarding. If they had that big of an effect on your Pokemon, then I bet... I bet it'll come in super handy for the treasure hunt assignment we've got. That's what I bet. Well, you both filled your bellies with some of my legendary sandwiches, so I guess it's time to tidy everything up. I guess so. Don't you worry about helping, though. After battling the Titan, you've earned a break. I like Arvin, man. He's nice. Leave it to me. But start searching out for the remaining four Herba Mystica. You got it. I'm curious what the other Titans are going to end up being. <laughs> I'm definitely having a sandwich for dinner. I'm telling you, I am actually starving for a Subway right now. I really owe you. The coast is clear. Wait, what? 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 You can come out now. What's he hiding? Arvin, what are you up to, buddy? I'm intrigued. This is Sada. I detect the Koridon has regained some original power. It seems it's now able to dash at high speeds. Dash by pressing the left stick, and if you strike a tree, Pokemon lurking up among the branches will fall down. Oh, so that's probably how you get, like, Heracross and the stuff that was on the tree earlier. Okay. Great. Your route is not fixed, but open before you. Seek out your own path, using your map and the tools you have at hand. Whenever you find your curiosity peaked, you should go and explore as your heart desires. All that you experience will help you grow in some way, great or small. Now go forth on your journey and take good care of Koridon for me. You got it. All right, off to the gym. I'm feeling good. This up. Jump off this. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go, good. Rare bone, very good. Max ether. Um, anything down here that I don't already, oh, skiddos? Got a bunch of skiddos. Here, let's go, um... I'll send Dofi out. There we go, Dofi. Take those guys out while I'm looking around. Dofi's actually perfect for this because he's flying and fighting, so he can fight all the grass ones with flying moves and fight the rock ones with fighting moves. Perfect. Here we go, there's some. Oh, I got an Ultra Ball, too. Fantastic. Man, Do Flamingo, dude! He's doing great. Level 19 already, too. Fantastic. Let's go. Take them all out. <laughs> I'm, I'm liking my team. I'm looking at the team on the side. I'm a fan. All right. I want to go to the town. I want to go to the gym battle. Oh, but see, but I'm seeing stuff. 
I keep getting distracted. Oh, Growlithe! Wait a minute, I want a Growlithe. Here we go. Don't kill him, Dofi. Just use a wing attack. Also, this is gonna be so useful against the grass type gym leader we're about to fight. Oh, good, 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 good. Pokeball, go! I gotta find me a Firestone, though. Beautiful. Beautiful. Growlithe was caught. I'm also curious when the Mushroom is gonna level up. Alright, Rock Polish, here we go. And here we are. The Puppy Pokemon, a brave and trustworthy nature, fearlessly stands up to bigger and stronger foes. Good stuff. Yeah, I feel like my squad is pretty good for a, like, grass gym coming up. I really do. Between the Flamingo and Quaxley having flying moves. It's pretty nice. Main reason I haven't switched out Fidobi is I want to see its evolution. Alright. How is the game so far? I am loving it, Metroid Dread. And by the way, Roger, Knockly evolves at level 24. Oh, awesome! I'll just, I'll keep him on the squad then, until he evolves. That's good, I don't have to wait very long. Just ran into your first shiny, a rookity? Hey, congratulations, Frosty. No shinies for me yet, but I'm keeping my eyes peeled. There we go, take out the cloth. Take this guy out, very good. Small of evolves at 25? Yeah, but see, he's not evolving. My small of is gonna be like level 100. I'm not evolving him. If I want to have a small of evolution, I have to catch another small of and then evolve that one. I refuse to evolve my regular small of. Won't do it. Do you know what your first shiny ever was, Roger? I do. It was a shiny Golbat in Pokemon Gold and Silver. Back in Gen 2. Oh, you got a rookity. Bum, 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 bum. We got Hyzant over there. Here. I'm going to send the Flamingo out to do some of this. I got to run to the bathroom. I've been streaming for so long. I'm going to run to the bathroom and get some water while um, Dofi's doing his thing. Give me one sec. Very good. Water obtained. Was able to go to the bathroom. We are good. All right. Take these guys out over here. To Artisan, you're nearly there. Fantastic. More of these guys. This auto battle feature, it really is so nice. Because then you're just sort of able to explore 
and little by little, you're not getting that much experience, but you're grinding a little bit. And you do get that bonus every time you take another one out. Man, oh man, oh man. Doflamingo's putting in work, I'll tell you. Did that just say Makuhita Sweat? By the way, Brayden Wood came up with the perfect name for Nackley. Fandom? Oh my gosh. <laughs> because they're salty? <laughs> That's actually really funny. That's actually really, really funny. <laughs> Phantom. Here we go. This'll be an easy battle. It's been a little, been a little while since the last time we fought one of these guys. Christina the student. All right, you're going down. Setting out ghastly. I really can't get over how much he just looks like a regular flamingo, though. <laughs> Perfect. But man, fighting and flying really is a great typing. But to send out Murkrow? No, I'm staying in, baby! Man, I'm getting flinched constantly. Speaking of, I got Joe Anderson in the chat saying, have they upped the flinch chance in this game? Bite seems to flinch more than not now. Yeah, I've been getting flinched a lot between the astonishes from some of the earlier battles, some bites. Maybe they did. Got two level ups here, fantastic. If that's how you battle, I'm sure you're gonna be able to find your treasure, fantastic. All right, get this. Fight this guy for me, Dofi, please and thank you. And there's a Terrasilize poking over there, so I want to go get him. Oh, he's all the way down there. I don't want to get that just yet. Because we're so close to the gym area, and I really do want to get that second badge. Oh, but there's a trainer. Dude, there's just stuff everywhere to do. There's a Shuppet over there, too. That's a new Pokemon. Gotta get myself a Shuppet. Uh, hold on. Alright, let's fight. Let's fight. Let's fight this guy. Over here. Oh, there's a little item over there, too? Alright, here we go. All the Pokemon are coming to watch our fight. What's your name? Amaya? Whoa, that is a big Apini. Too bad it's gonna get absolutely destroyed. <laughs> Low kick. Gone. I think it's kind of funny that Doflamingo is one of the strongest Pokemon <laughs> in my team. <laughs> I was expecting to use him, but I really like him a lot. All right. I want to get this berry I also just kind of want to explore this is fun all right we're running no other items over here for the time being I do want to get the drift loon though hold on oh oh those are the parakeets I want to get the parakeets too how many pokeballs do I have two one and two okay I can do this. Okay. Boom. Easy. Pokeball. What? He popped out? The more Titans you fight, the easier it's going to be to get around without too much skill. See, that's good to know. After this gym battle, I'll probably go after the second Titan. We'll probably start the stream tomorrow with the second Titan. Also, why am I losing to this Drifloon? Here, I'll use uh, Great Ball. This should work. And I want to catch one of those Parakeets. 
Okay. Drifloon was caught. Fantastic. Perfect. 22. That's what I like to see. It's whispered any child who mistakes Drifloon for a balloon and holds on to it could wind up missing. Creepy. Drifloon always had weird, creepy things. Alright. There we go. New Pokemon has been registered. I see an Oricorio there as well. I'm gonna make Karu first. I wanna get the Oricorio. I wanna get the Parakeet. I wanna fight the gym. Keep me on track, everybody. I wanna beat the gym. <laughs> Alright, Aqua Jet. Let's see if it survives this. It did. Perfect. He's in peck. Perfect. Throw an Ultra Ball. Obviously, we're going to name this one Viola. Oh, man. All right, let's hope I was able to catch it on this next one. If not, we may just have to wait and get the parakeets later. Is the stream going to be the, uh, the same time tomorrow? I might tune in later then. Uh, the stream will... Ah, oh, shoot. It popped out. The stream will be tomorrow, I think, starting at 10. No, Karoom! Oh, I didn't even notice! I'll switch in Heizen. I'm sorry, Karu. I'll leave you up, buddy. I'm sorry. I wasn't paying attention. All right, here we go. Here we go. Rock throw. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Here we go. Fantastic. Please mean 10 in the morning? Yeah, 10 in the morning, exactly. Heizant's a great name for uh, Nackley. Oh my gosh. I know, right? Because of the salt? Alright, here we go. Heal the Pokemon. I also just like Heizant and Triangle Strategy. That was such a cool area. Alright. Hold on. I kind of want to buy some Pokeballs. I want to catch that Parakeet. I'm going to buy a couple Great Balls. Let's do... Do five. And let's do... A lot of potions. Fantastic. Very good. Alright. Oh, I want to get up there too. Oh, Murkrows! By the way, the town called Cascarafa has the Straw Hats for sale? Oh, I, you know I need that. You know I need that! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, that Murkrow! Hold on a minute. Karu, are you slipping? What's going on here, Karu? Alright. All stat changes were eliminated, all right. Wing attack. There we go, there we go, there we go. Great ball. Isn't Cascarafa where I am right now? How is the Pokemon breaking free? He's like a level 18 and I've got a great ball. Now let's see. There you go, there you go, that should do it. What? All right, fine, Karu. You know what? Fine. End him. There you go. All right. Good work, Karu. Good work. Oh, my gosh. I keep running into all these stupid Murkrow. All right. Another one. Let's do wing attack. You got to go. Have a good rest of the stream. Of course, you got it. Have a good rest of your evening. Okay. I love that the evolutions are just roaming all over the place in this game. Are they? I didn't know that. That's cool. You got this, Karu. Come on. Perfect. All right, one last one. I'm switching him in. 
Kuru, I'm swapping you out for High Zant. Boom, 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 boom. I also just realized I have to check the Terra types of all the Pokemon that I have currently. Okay, Gust. Rock Throw. Very good. Fantastic. Murkrow Fainted. Smolive's level 20. Wants to learn Mega Drain. Oh, it's time. Ha <laughs> ha! That's good. All right. Perfect. All right, let's go heal up again. I'm going to switch just so I get a little extra experience on him before the battle. I'm going to switch Amy Adams first. Then I'm going to heal. Ba -ba -da -ba. Ba -ba 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 -da 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 -da. I've heard about all the game's performance issues. How has it been playing for you so far? It's been fine. There's been little like weird blips here and there, like graphical blips or glitches with the camera, but on the whole, it's it's been totally fine. I've been enjoying myself. All right. Oh, I love this town with all the flowers everywhere and the got the windmill up there too. All right. Let's go to the gym. Gym 2, baby. I have not gotten my flying type Pikachu yet. I know I got to get that. Let me also see real quick. Just checking. Terra type flying. Rock, water, grass, fairy, flying. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, that's a reminder, though. I do have to get that Pikachu. Via Rogers Base? It's so wild we ended up randomly visiting the same gym at the same time again. What a weird coincidence. Are you following me? I swear I'm not just sneaking ahead of you and going, Oh, wow. Weird. Might as well battle now that you're here. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Add these to the mix. Oh, Ethers, cool. I'll be cheering for you. Like maybe 20 Pokemon or so while you tackle the gym. All right, you got it. Train away. Welcome to the Artisan Gym. Let me register you as a challenger. Roger's base, yes? Yes, indeed. All right, let's pass the gym test. Completing a game of Sunflora Hide and Seek. Okay. Artisans is a city of artists, and the artwork made by the people here is largely inspired by nature and the sun that nurtures it. Since Sunflora embodies these concepts, we try to gather them and take good care of them. Your job today is to find the Sunflora located throughout Artisan. Remember, these Pokemon look like sun-shaped flowers. Gather ten of them and then bring them to the Sunflora lawn and you'll pass the test. All right, you got it. Turn right and you'll see two large Sunflora statues. Head for those. When you're at the lawn's entrance, the staffer will tell you more about the gym test. You got it. It's so weird that the gyms aren't... Like, you go to the gym to check in for your gym test, but the actual battles and stuff aren't in the gym. Very weird. All right. Let's see. Go to the Sunflora lawn. What is that supposed to be? It's kind of cool. Got a pool over here and everything. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. That's what I meant to do. Open up the camera a little bit. Okay, here we go. Ready to gather up some flora? I sure am. I'll ask the some flora to spread themselves out around town? Okay. Sounds like the Sunflora are ready for you. Your gym test has begun. When you found 10, bring them back here to the Sunflora lawn. Sounds easy enough. Seek out the Sunflora and Artisan. 
Okay, I've always liked Sunflora. I think it's a cute little Pokemon. Da -da 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 All right, let's see. Look for some little Sunfloras all over the place. Where? Oh, oh, there's something over here. Wait a minute. It's an item. I want that. Super Potion. You guys said, here comes the lag? Oh, no, I don't want to leave town. Let's keep going. All right, let's see. Let's see. I'm not seeing Sunflora anywhere. I guess it is hide and seek, so. Oh, there's one. The Sunflora will now follow you around. Okay, let's go. Let's see, any other ones over here? No. <laughs> He's hopping around. All right, let's see. There's one. Go up on an upper level. Let's see. Oh, there's another one. Get him. There's two. Okay. Let me see. Roger, did you know you could play co-op on the same map and progress everything like normal while alongside your friends? I did, actually. I did. But I want to play by myself for the first couple days at least, just while I'm getting the hang of things. I'm still accidentally clicking the wrong buttons in the menus and stuff, so... I probably won't do co-op for a little while at least. Alright, here we go. Another Sunflora. I see another one over there. <laughs> it's so funny just seeing them wandering around like this. Look at that. <laughs> just follow me around everywhere. Cute. I see one over there, too. Here we go. Got a quick claw. That's pretty good. Okay, here we are. Another one. Okay, let's see. I have six of them. I need ten. Where would they... Oh, no, I don't want to lose. No, 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 no. Turn around. I'm sure there's some in that maze over there. I'm, like, leaping around trying to see in there. Um... Oh, there's an item. Fling! Oh, TM56, that's Fling, son! But you don't know because you never even had one! This ain't a roast, but if it was, it'd be a countdown! <laughs> Yo, cool. It's one of my favorite TMs. I love Fling. Alright, great. Here we go. Here's another Sunflora. Seven of them, great. Uh, oh, there's something over there. A dead end? What happened? Oh, I'm talking to his Pokemon. Guard special, cool. Oh, there's the sun floor. I see him. There we go! Little baby Sunflora popping out of there. Yo, look at these sun... <laughs> look at all these little Sunflora around me. That's so funny. All right, let's see. Another one. That's nine. I'm missing one. Okay, Poison Tail. Ooh, ooh. The Harvest, a work by Brasius. Okay, so he made that. 
Wait, while I'm here, wait, bag? Poison tail. That's incredibly useful for the gym we're in right now. Oh, but nobody can learn it. I was thinking uh, Obi could learn it, but he can't. Let's see. Acid spray, struggle bug. No, that's fine. Oh, he could learn fling. I'm not going to give it to him yet, though. Is there a Sunflora in here? Yes, there is. I got him. You found him. Time to bring him to the Sunflora lawn. Okay. Get out of here. <laughs> I'm a bit behind, but I saw you catch Fido when you said, you know what, we gotta name him. I thought you were gonna go with Katakuri. Fido be fits much better though. <laughs> Katakuri is a good name for Fido. All right. Where are we going? The Sunflora Lawn. Oh, over here, okay. Here we go. These little Sunflora, man. I know, look at the frame right on them. They're running like one frame at a time behind you. Oh, that's funny. Seek out the Sunflora and Artisan. You passed. Beautiful. All right. They could be all happy now. Perfect. Well done finding the Sunflora. You passed the gym test with flying colors. Now head back to the lobby at the Artisan Gym to report your result. Perfect. Let's go. Okay. Do I have a favorite Pokemon type? You know, it shifts day to day. Sometimes I like ice. Sometimes I like grass. Sometimes I like electric. Sometimes I like normal. It really depends. Okay. You gathered 10 Sunflora, which means you cleared the gym test. You've earned the right to challenge the gym leader. I am ready. Yes, I am. The verdant virtuoso. I am ready. Allow me to show you the battle court. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Greetings, Challenger! Hmm? You did well to come this far. I am Brassius, an artist specializing in grass-type Pokémon, and I'm also the gym leader here at the Artisan Gym. I was observing your gym test from atop the windmill, you know. The perception you displayed in finding Sunflora was truly... How do I describe it? It was truly avant-garde. He reminds me so much of Hubert from Fire Emblem. <laughs> I only pray that you might demonstrate that eye for beauty in our battle as well. Enough talk. We must begin creating our collaborative work of art. I trust that you are ready. It is time for our masterpiece to take shape. I'm ready. He's got the whip and everything. You are challenged by gym leader Brassius. Now you know what we gotta do here. We're flame charging all day, every day. And then we're gonna tear a stall at the ending. All right, flame charge. Boom. Be speedier than the pet lil. Good work, Amy Adams. About to send out Smoliv. Will you send in a Pokemon? I'm keeping in Amy Adams. I'm good. Here we go. Flame charge again. Easy. And then I already know, based on the trailer, he's going to do Sudo Udo next, right? I'm going to switch my Pokemon. Yes, I am. Switch with Doflamingo. Mm -hmm. 
This is promise, yes. Let us lead this artistic endeavor to its conclusion at once. All right, this way if he uses a rock type move, I'll resist it, won't be a problem. Let us terrestrialize, because he's gonna terrestrialize too. Uh, actually, you know what, no. We can mess with him, let's pounce. I just wanna see what this does. Allow me to touch up this work slightly. I will call it Trule Wudo. <laughs> Here we go. With the giant sunflower on his head. <laughs> Here we go. Doflamingo used pounce. And his speed fell, so it didn't even matter. Fantastic. At times like this, art becomes a race against the clock. Let us increase the pace. You got it. Trailblaze. What does that do? It's not very effective at all. Okay. Look, two can play at this game. Do Flamingo, show him your conqueror's hockey. Grow those balloons on your head. <laughs> Dopey used wing attack. Gone. <laughs> Goodbye, Trule Wudo. So long, buddy. Look at this. Finobi even leveled up. <laughs> Man, he is mad. Avant guard. That's perfect for a thumbnail right there. Just his angry face. <laughs> I love it. What artistic tactics do you employ? The patterns of your moves, the minute details of your Pokemon's performance, everything you did was honed to perfection. Our battle was in a word, art. Indeed, if we could not call that work of artistry, then nothing else in the world could be labeled as such. If I were to judge your work, I would say it passes my inspection. Yes. A pass, without exception. As proof of your artistic prowess, you may have my gym badge. Shall we take a photo as well? We shall! <laughs> Artisan Gym defeated. Wonderful. If you possess two gym badges, it will be easier to catch Pokemon of up to level 30. And those Pokemon should follow your commands as well. Fantastic. To a fantastic trainer such as yourself, I would also like to offer this, a favorite of mine. Trailblaze. Now what does this do exactly? The user attacks suddenly as if leaping out from a tall grass. The user's footwork boosts its speed. I'm curious how much it does. Like, obviously we'll teach that to Smoliv. My inspiration is overflowing, as if drawn from a bottomless well. I will begin on a new piece at once. Farewell! Farewell indeed, Brassius. A.K.A. Hubert. Alright. I want to see what the base damage does. Because I think that might be a good move for Smoliv. Pardon me, would you be the Rogers base I've been hearing about? Who are you? Nimona mentioned that there was a promising new face in the Academy. But I do apologize. I didn't mean to startle you by addressing you so suddenly. I'm Hassel, one of the Elite Four of the Pokemon League. I teach art classes at the Academy. So do tell me, young Rogers base, what compels you to collect these gym badges and strive to be a champion? I want to find my treasure. The One Piece! Asked and answered, thank you. Naturally, there's no single correct answer. All paths lead to the great crater of Paldea, as they say. You know, your friend Nimona is the youngest to achieve champion rank in all of Paldean history. It's possible that such great potential lies within you, too. He looks like some famous actor, and I can't put my finger on it. Should you continue striving to reach champion rank, you will one day have to battle me. I look forward to it. You'd be wise to train hard now. It will save you from experiencing the bitter regret of defeat. And do come along to my art class sometime. I'd be thrilled to have you attend. You got it. Maybe next stream. All right, Pokedex has been updated. I want to see my bag. Let's see. 
Hasty mint. What is this? Having it smell this mint will make its speed stack grow stronger. Oh. Trailblaze. 50 and it's physical. Oh, and clearly Small of's evolution is using it. Oh, but Fido can learn it too. Wait a minute. Razor Leaf is 55, a boost critical hit. Trailblaze boosts the speed. I don't want to use that on him yet. I think Razor Leaf and Mega Drain are both good enough. That might be good on Fidobi. We'll see. I'm not going to use it yet. I want to wait and see who's going to be like more permanent on the team. We'll see. Here we go. I want to open this up. Pokedex has been updated. We have language classes available to take. Also, you know what I, I'm going to do? I am going to... Get out of here temporarily. And... Here we go. I'm going to fly to the academy. I still think it's so funny that... Rotom Phone has become such a huge part of the games ever since Alola. I like it. I actually, I really like the fact that you've all got your Rotom Phones now, but it's just funny. Like when Rotom was first announced as a Pokemon back in Gen 4, I didn't think he'd be this integral. All right, let me see this. Bag. I want to auto heal. Oops, not what I wanted to do. Auto heal. Change position, I want to put you first. Change position. There we go. Perfect, I like that. I like that. I am going to take a photo there of my current progress. I'm gonna to go to my bag. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm gonna to go to my save. I realize this is the first time I've saved the entire game so far. <laughs> and then I wanna go here. Got my Pokedex. Take a photo of this. Also, are there like any extra things I can get yet? Here we go. Change photo. Profile picture. How do you take a new photo? Oh, cute! Cute, cute, cute. <laughs> That's so cute! <laughs> I love it! Wait, get out of my photo, lady. Wait, can I put small of out? Wait, 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 wait. If we're gonna take a photo, let me take a photo, hold on. Move to first position. Here we go. Because could I also send out everybody? Like, hold on. If I want to send out... Oh no, I have to have one. Because I want to take a photo with all my Pokemon. If you do a picnic, you can do it? Alright, let me see. Do a picnic to send everyone out. Alright, I want to do that. Um... Oh, picnic. Here we go. Here we go! Can I do a picnic on the school grounds? Like, right here? Oh, no. It says probably not best to host one here. Alright, fine. Then we'll get out of here. And I'll fly to... Let's just fly back right here to Artisan. We're already here, we might as well. And then we'll make a picnic, and then I can take a photo with my whole team. And that'll be cute. Because it'll be like right where we leave off tonight. We're going to pick up from there tomorrow on Twitch. But I want to have a good solid photo of everybody. Oh yeah, this is a good spot. South Province. Okay. Picnic. Here we go. Throw ball. Okay. 
Oh, cool! Got the whole squad together. This is so cute. All right, whistle. Come on, everybody. Everybody come over here. Cute. Coridon, stay to the side so I can get everyone in the photo. All right, hold on. And selfie mode, right? What? Yo! What the heck? He's sleeping? Oh, there's Fidobi! This selfie mode is so cute. I cannot get over it. Yeah, I want to take a selfie from here so I can get everybody in it. But everyone's sleeping. Hold on. I want to get a good one. Hold on. Everybody wake up. Wake up, everyone. Wake up. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, that's cute. Cute, 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 cute. Um, all right. Emote. That's actually really funny. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> I want to get it with Smalov running around and Dofi right there in the middle. That's a cute one. Is there a way to hide the emotes too? Like if I don't want the emotes on the screen? Oh, hide guide. There you go, hide guide. Filters. Oh, fisheye lens. Whoa, what? Interesting. No filter. Rotate the camera a little bit. Da 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 da. Hide guide. Because I'm trying to find where I would have the image. Hold on. I like that, because they could have it on the side and then have the thing flipped. Oh, cute! Cute! Oh, cute, 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 cute! Stay right there! Wait, stay right there! Stay right there! Oh, cute! Fight! Oh, oh, that's cute! That's cute! I like it! I'm over here posing for thumbnails. You got Small Live in the back, chilling. I like it. All right, I've got enough. I've got enough. All right. Pack up and go. We're all done picnicking. We're good for now. All right. I'm going to save it again right here. There we go. And then if I go to my map, doesn't it give me, like, my current progress? If I zoom out? There we go. Perfect. All right. Excellent, excellent. That is totally going to be the thumbnail for tomorrow. Me going like this. I'm going to make it right now for the stream tomorrow that's going to be on Twitch that's going to go up on YouTube. So once again, everybody, this was an absolute blast. I had so much fun playing Pokemon Scarlet today. I, I love this. I love this game. I know and can acknowledge there are definitely issues. I feel like the way certain things pop in and out... I feel like the FPS is kind of weird sometimes, but on the whole, the game itself this time is so good. It is so good. There is so much stuff to do. The Pokemon variety is great. I've been having a blast. Obviously, I stream six hours, so obviously I like it. But massive thank you to everybody who came by. Once again, thank you to Pokemon Company for retweeting my stream. Thank you to YouTube Gaming for retweeting my stream. Thank you to Nintendo for sending the game my way. Again, I'll be playing more tomorrow morning, twitch.tv slash rogersbase, and I'll be uploading it right here to YouTube afterwards. And of course, if you want more Pokemon Scarlet shoots from me, make sure you subscribe so you get notified of when I go live. Um, the next Next one that will be streamed live on YouTube, because again, tomorrow's is going to be streamed live on Twitch and then uploaded to YouTube. The next one streamed live on YouTube will most likely be on Monday morning. And then uh, we're going to see from there how many more I do or when I'll, I will be streaming more of the game. But I am taking my time with this one. I really am just going to enjoy myself, explore the world, fill out my Pokedex. I'm in no rush to get to the champion or beat every gym or whatever. I'm just taking my time, having fun with all of you. So once again, thank you so much everybody for tuning in. Like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, talk to you guys later. Bye-bye everybody!